it is time for another Linux Gamecast Weekly. Still waiting on the tubes. No, there we not. go. <laughs> it's happening. I know it's coming out there. What's it's up? It's live now. <laughs> Man, welcome back to the only show that covers banana eating etiquette and Linux gaming. Watch a big man yes. and a big banana. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I went for the big bananas. I'm a big boy. I'm hungry. <laughs> See, like, I was really going to go fucking buy a banana so I could hold it up for scale. Like, no pun intended. <laughs> but I, refu oh, I oh. refused. All right, on principle alone, I'm not buying a singular prepackaged banana. It's disgusting. Dude. <laughs> Dude, if you told me that, I would have ha held a banana outside the scale sign and got a photo. <laughs> banana for I, scale. <laughs> I, 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 I didn't even think of that, man. That's, 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 oh. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Do not worry, ladies and gentlemen. We are, after all, trained broadcasting professionals. <laughs> that's right. None of that is true. Uh, <laughs> fresh from scale, that is Jordan. We're, we're going to be talking about that instead of the uh, chairquisition this week. We're going to bring in a couple of people. Yeah. And they're going to say things. Be like, oh my God, it was horrifying. Jordan chased us around for hours. It's true. <laughs> that... You don't think a man my size has um, good endurance, but I do. See, here's he the way do, I look at it, gentlemen. He do. <laughs> this, this is why I run six kilometers, what, five days a week, is because if I can't get away from whatever's trying to fuck me in six clicks, I got bigger problems, man. <laughs> See, you, you, you don't have to outrun Jordan. You have to outrun the person in front of Jordan. Pretty much, yeah. You got to be careful with things on the desk, though. I mean... Ah, uh, yeah, um... <laughs> No, no, let me just hold it between your thighs <laughs> with the banana peel oh yeah that'd be great if that went wrong <laughs> oh we do actually have a show put together for you this week ladies and gentlemen man i yeah i was, I was trying, every every time i went to like do something in the show notes i'm, I'm reading through them all week and then as i'm about to type something strider's like here smoke this joint or it's like, let's play some video games, sir. I'm like, fine. All right, fine, Smokey. If, if I have to. If I had a million dollars. There we go. So, that's, about, that's about right. Let's make sure that hat's a little Nick's Foundation hat and we're good. <laughs> Pink belt. Truggy lost his. I had to give him mine. <laughs> Pink belt? No, uh, Linux Foundation hats. Uh. Oh, 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 oh. The, um, so, mid, the, they, ha they have auditions or some shit for America's Got Talent going on also in the convention center. Oh, hell. <laughs> yeah, they set up a they set up a ballista the other day. They're gonna fire someone out of it. Yeah, empty took a little bit of a video about. It. I was like, where is this going? Is this part of scale? <laughs> I wish. And the other part was like, I would so try to ride that. Ride the trebuchet or ride, ride the ballista. Oh, they had a trebuchet I'd be on that shit too, man. It's like, but <laughs> fuck I mean, me, bitch. We haven't set it up. Steve, It'll sort itself. Steve out. has a trebuchet. He he built he built a little one. Yeah, man. I you should not leave me alone in Jill Steve's house. I will just disassemble everything there. <laughs> He's got a lot of cool tchotchkes though. Yeah. Right. I'll buy your charge keys. <laughs> Sell me your watch, please. This is what happens, man. You never pay attention to fucking <laughs> lyrics. You make up your own damn lyrics and you sing them back. <laughs> That's weird, Al. <laughs> it's the eBay song. <laughs> uh, hmm. I think yeah, the, last, yeah, yeah, the last one I listened to was uh, 
not song, but last album had uh, what was it? Uh, Craigslist on it. Mm. It was like the Doors cover, but uh, like you can find everything on Craigslist. Hmm. Yeah. I don't know. I had uh, bad hair day on extended loan for a long ass time. <laughs> www.tw What would the do? What, what, what? The do. What, what? what? There's a W after that, too. <laughs> the, 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 the third W is silent. It's, for, it's, like, it's like George W. Bush. <laughs> I can't see shit. <laughs> also, Tonight, Linux Gamecast is brought to you by Acer. Acer. <laughs> and Isabel. This is how you do it. If you want a free plug, send me a giant ass monitor, Phillips. <laughs> Phillips, Asus, yeah. Samsung. Anyone, LG, really. anyone really <laughs> i mean samsung i'm just saying you know you like the bigger logo come on like 50 yet yeah g-sync -G come on you, you know you want to i think this might have hdr but it's not free sync or anything but i give zero f I, yeah <laughs> 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 you, you, you can't just you can't just lick me and run away. Come here, my 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 love. <laughs> my okay, Strider has been drinking. <laughs> How can you tell? I'm being a hundred percent honest. Honest, man. How can you tell? <laughs> I would say careful, don't drop him on his head, but. Yeah. <laughs> I think the air would, the hair would cushion. <laughs> ah. Be careful. He, he's vintage. Right. <laughs> what do I taste like, by the way? Uh, not. Not very, good. Not not very spicy, good. So. I've had some hot sauce, if I remember. Alright, I need hot sauce. Cool. Yes, you need hot sauce. More spices and... Like, sure, yeah, yeah. <laughs> what do I taste like? Jordan Svong, 2019. <laughs> well, that was the thing. Like, he come in and licked me. I was going to be like, no, man. You're going to give me some... I was, I was expecting him to smooch me. Oh, man. I would have grabbed that tongue. <laughs> Yeah, like I, I, I was like mentally prepared to just French the motherfucker, um, but then then he then he ran off. I'm like, no, come, come back. Uh, expect more such interruptions all throughout the night. It's it's the LGC variety hour. Oh, speaking speaking of which, there's we got, got strawberry flavored Hellalks. Yes. <laughs> And we got ginger flavored. That's starting to show you. Yeah, then. Oh, oh we, we got, we got Alan, the spinal tap going seriously, too. Seriously, Alan, yeah. that's kind of fucking yes. meta, don't you think? <laughs> oh, no, he's been doing it all, all, all week. It's great. Yeah, but he, he never put an SD card in it. This is why. <laughs> Maybe? I don't know. It's all saved into in the RAM. There, 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 there is an SD card in there. All right. Uh, do you want an earbud, Jill? <laughs> sit down and entertain no, the people. No, she was just going to sit there oh, awkwardly until she got one. Yes. No, no. Oh. oh, come on. You should have let her put the other <laughs> Hi, Jill. Wrong show, hello, Jill. Oh, hello. Uh, we got... Oh, it keeps falling out. My ears are too small. <laughs> um, uh... Yeah, so we got lots of really, really good video, but good interviews with people everywhere from the Linux Journal to GNU Health, um, um, uh, various people on the floor who have really good, amazing uh, 
open source projects and Popey. <laughs> oh yeah, he's there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I can barely hear this one. Bar bar barely hear this. Let's see. <laughs> 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 yeah, so it's it's really amazing. It's just been amazing, and um, um, I was just asked by the All Things Open P uh, uh, conference. They said they'd like to fly me in into uh, 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 to the conference back east and have me talk. <laughs> That's pretty good. That's pretty yeah. good. <laughs> you know, Gary said the same thing, and I've never heard from him since. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I can barely hear yeah. them. Oh. Uh, <laughs> um. <laughs> Too many years of rock and roll, oh, Jill. PAVU control? Okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was going to turn it up, but I didn't want to mess up your settings. <laughs> Live like this one. If... Okay. I, I don't want to touch my... the output, it should be fine. There we go. <laughs> yeah, well, that's there what I'm go. saying, man. I don't have my no, mock returns actually mapped to the buses or be actively fucking with return audio, but. <laughs> I got it. <laughs> There's a Mac geek lurking in the background. It's the easiest show I've ever done. Yes. <laughs> there is a Mac geek lur lurking in the background. <laughs> right. We do. <laughs> Yeah, we're going to bring everyone in. A, his... You want me to bring everyone in? No, I said we're going to bring everyone in after the news. Oh, okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Sounds Instead good. of doing the review, we're going to just have everyone come in and talk scale. <laughs> okay, cool. Awesome. Oh, yeah, Vin. So another thing that happened, I, you know... Um, uh, see, see Emma at the, I've seen Emma from System76, of course, from the last uh, few scales, and we've been tweeting each other, and um, um, she said that at System76, they set up, um, they're actually creating a game, and they put me as a character in one of their game, in their game, to as an exemplary member of the community. <laughs> I guess I'm gonna be in one of the games. <laughs> she didn't. She she uh, in in the in the interview she talks about it a little bit more. All right, that's cool. <laughs> nice. Yes. I am so you know exhausted from a lot of talking. That <laughs> oh boy, but it's been it really has been wonderful. <laughs> And what's kind of cool is, you know, for years, everyone at Scales always, you know, know me from the Linux chicks. And now I'm getting people come up, oh, I watch your podcast. You know, you do a great job. And it's just now people want to are coming up and talking to me. And it's weird. <laughs> so, but it's very cool. <laughs> You did get a modicum amount of uh, internet exposure from LWDW. Very, oh, yes, definitely. very tidy, but yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and oh, what was really cool is all the uh, Red Hat people came to congratulate me about my nomination. And yeah, uh, uh, several of them said, yeah, you placed really high. <laughs> so <laughs> that was really cool. So. Didn't make it to the finalist, so nah. Mm -mm. no. No, no. <laughs> but but I, I I made it through the second round, like at the top, like really close. <laughs> All right, give me Jordan back. We got to do a show. Yes. Yes. Okay. Jordan, I think he's sleeping. <laughs> yes, he's resting. Um. <laughs> I'm not actually I know, I know, I know. You're just <laughs> doing it as entertainment <laughs> for the show. Yeah, Jordan really didn't fall asleep. <laughs> just having fun. <laughs> okay, you need to tell but, him yeah. that he needs we to come still and need him have back. a seat. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, so, <laughs> so, Jordan, they want you back to start the show. 
Ah, of course. Fine. He said, ah, oh, fine. Fine, 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 fine. <laughs> <laughs> These headphones are so funky. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Mm. Aww. <laughs> well, nap time's over. Hey, man. Ador, I know you're going to fuck me at some point tonight. Just be gentle. <laughs> yeah, sometimes sometimes you gotta, uh, fuck her gently. Discreetly. <laughs> we gotta see, man. What's your favorite dish? <laughs> Let's see. I'm not going to cook it, but I'll order in from Zanzibar. <laughs> Zanzibar! <laughs> Sometimes you've got to Before we to get squeeze. started, if anybody knows a universal command to change all of the um, automation curves <laughs> on a door, that'd be nice. Let me know. Call me. All right. Uh, showtime. Yes. Yes. What tapping shit? I'm just making sure I can see things. Okay, hang on. We'll keep doing it so I can gate it. All right. Oh, it's the scroll wheel. <laughs> yeah. All right. Are we good? Uh, yeah, should be. All right. Uh, right, 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 right. That looks good. Okay. Let's do it, ladies and gentlemen. Everybody. Okay. Uh, I don't trust this program. <laughs> Doesn't have the right hotkeys. <laughs> Many things. And welcome back to another Linux Emcast Weekly the show that covers the latest Linux gaming news, reviews, how tos, and most importantly, whatever the hell else we come up with this week. Um, Vulcan. It's a cool, cool technology. And Rust is technically a game, and they've tried to use it probably in the most incompetent way possible. And Humble 20 has hopped onto the scene, so you can pay what you want. For a bunch of cool games, except for one that's kind of weird that I really didn't want to buy for reasons. More on that at 11. Coming soon, a story about missed release dates. Actually, you know, it fucking will do it later. And Linux gets some more free games, but is it a good thing? Valve sacked some people. Spool up that rumor mill, kids. And Kitty Digest tells us all about the easiest way to game on Linux. Yeah, it's one of those articles. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I'm frantically looking for buttons because a lot of things are in different places and I can't see half the things. Um, I'm Vin Stone. Joining us live from next to near scale in a bungalow. Mm -hmm. hidden pa pa Pasadena. In Pasadena, which is like right on top of scales, hovering above it. That's Jordan Swing. Yeah. And you know him, you love him. That's Pedro in Britannia on the island with his Heineken. Mm -hmm. With his Heine. Yes. And you down there in bottom. <laughs> Shadow Realm Dynamic joining us live for this very special, not really, but it's still kind of special episode of Linux Gamecast Weekly. Uh, before we get started, we'd like to see what's going on. I'll just go ahead and fucking say, not much. Can't think of anything that's happened here. Pretty much the same old. No? No? Mm -mm. Yeah, it doesn't look like everything's changed. No, no, it's regular. No, no, no. no. Yeah. It's, it's a, this show brought to you by Acer. <laughs> Technically, you can't see it in this shot. It's a dying of fire, man. Um, right. So that's... Th this this happened. <laughs> it's so huge. That's so big. That's a you, big you look like thing. Wilson. I... You look like Wilson from Home Improvement. Dude, all right, couple of things. I've said something this monitor that will never be said to me, and it's you're too big. 
Um, <laughs> <laughs> too real, man. Too, too real. real. Right. Uh, yeah, I, I picked this up for, like, why did you end up with this? I didn't want this. I wasn't looking for something like this. It was $308 all in. That's yeah, a for a monitor mine. that big, that's pretty good. Yeah, pretty <laughs> damn good. Uh, certified refurbished and all that. Da, 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 they're normally like six hundred bucks. Uh, pretty happy with it. I, this is not where it's going to be. This is like fuck it. I'm going to do one episode like that plus the floor stand for it. So that's going to be a thing. Uh, it works. It's pretty nice. It's kind of glossy, and I'm like one of those shallow bastards that would gauge how well his life was going by the size of the monitor because i know if like boom if i boot back in time uh, it, like 2005 like oh shit future event how big's the monitor and if i would have said you know what this other monitor here is like 28 28.5 i'm like well shit i guess life's going very well however however if i boot back in time to 2005 and it's like so future event how big's the monitor 43 inches i would look at other <laughs> vin and go be quiet drugs <laughs> did you hit the lottery or <laughs> it's ridiculous but it's going to let us is we now have the screen real estate to bring on guest which we're going to be doing wednesday uh i think chibs is going to be our sacrificial test lamb plus i'm learning a lot of things not to worry about automation and i'm waiting for it to bite me in the ass there that was long boring give me something exciting jordan <laughs> All right, let, let, me, let me tell you about my new best friend that I met at a grocery store called Ralph's. Um, <laughs> yes. So, so we're, we're, we're going to get food for breakfast because we got a dozen freaking As opposed to what for breakfast? Uh, <laughs> it's California. You know exactly what. I know. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, any, 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 anyways, yeah, there's... um. Yeah, so so we're we're gonna get eggs and shit. There's a dozen of us, uh, and we're we're going through the house. We're at the checkout line, and I look up, and fucking full on crackhead. He's like voguing in the middle of the freaking grocery store. You like scratching Strider himself. Get back in the car. Oh no, no. <laughs> Strider, Strider was there too. He was like, oh. Oh man, yeah, no, it, was, it was it was pretty great. Um, no, uh, all the scale stuff's been going on. I guess I, I have the segment. And the internet with oh, the poop. You blinked. You're good. <laughs> I blinked. You're ah, good. Let's, let's, all right. It's, I, I have minimal control over the technical issues here. Um, yeah. Uh, so, uh, so that, yeah. Um, scale's been going all right so far. Went to a couple talks. Uh, shilled for Lutris for a couple days. And yeah, I got to hang out with some cool people. And I'm waiting on my steak, which empty has quite literally drowned in Montreal steak uh, spice. Hmm. So that's going to be fun. You can take the boy very, out of Jersey. Uh, Pedro, Canadian. what's up? <laughs> uh, over here, uh, well, my uh, my vacation's coming to an end, and I finished Fallout 4, 150 hours in, give so, or take. So how, how many times do you think you could have walked to the Raspberry Pi store and back during that time? Uh, probably about 75 times. <laughs> <laughs> Give or take. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I didn't go there because I was just lazy. <laughs> Pretty much. LGC cares. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. So, what's the so horse I, I, up I, to I, this week, baby? I mean, I mean, the horse has not shown their face in California. I'm a little disappointed. I guess we may have to do it without them. It's the Steam Limit! Update so, uh, we've talked uh, about this a little bit um, vis-a-vis the problem with listing release dates for games on Steam. You're not really beholden to them. And uh, this article from uh, th- uh, Thread Reader, I was about to say Thread Rip Rap, but it's Thread Reader App, <laughs> uh, is going on about how um, various companies are abusing it. And while a lot of these things are just like, oh, uh, we, we missed our release date, because that's, that's, a really, that's a real thing that happens in software. Um, there are a lot of uh, there are a lot of um, developers who are abusing the this to get to the top of the new releases chart, and it's actually pushing newer games down, so they're not getting as much exposure as before. And uh, yeah, this this uh, art- article just laments about it, and it it is a pretty rough practice. Um, just and like there's not really much you can do about it because missing release dates are a thing that happened in software projects. 
So how, how, how do you verify that it's like done in good faith or not? Hmm. Yeah, we've seen this done a few times and games that set a release date and then they either forget that they set that release date and they hit a bit of a snag so they're going to have to delay and then they don't change it. Or people doing so deliberately to drive up interest or if they have, say, a money gathering campaign going on. It's like, oh, this is putting more eyes on it because the game is coming up and people click on it and it's like, ooh, they're getting money. This looks interesting, so we'll give them more money. It's, yeah, it, it's kind of a crappy situation. One of the things I genuinely don't like about it is I, I understand the thought, the mentality behind it, the thought process of like, hey, man, it's free promotion. I'll just bump my game, you know, goose it just a little mm -hmm. bit and it'll get it in front of everybody. The problem is like the ninth time you've done that, People get tired of your shit. And mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. that one particular game, which I know we've covered on the show, which kind of looked like rocket cars, but you play with like actual people running around or some shit like that. You know the one. I'm talking yeah. About. Yeah. Yeah. They even have a thread in their forums where I'm actively participating every time they do it. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, stop doing that, man. Come on, guys. Come it's not, on. All right. It's not, it's not cool. Beta, beta. Yeah. Okay, so there was a new update for the Steam client beta. If you're on the betas, you probably saw this coming a couple of days ago. And it uh, it has a few things. It has updates to the shared installer content now being listed under Steamworks Common Redistributables, uh, which if you have a look at your library, it, they're actually showing up there now. And Proton now shows up as an installed tool. <laughs> Uh, the, they improved broadcasting, but that doesn't work on Linux, so fuck that. Uh, they enabled the Vulkan pipeline dumping and collection if shader pre-caching is enabled, so that's good. And, finally, for Linux specific, you don't see that very often, they have fixed more instances of zero-byte downloads and missing Proton or data files for Steam Play titles, and they've added the Steam Play configuration settings in big picture mode. Took you long enough, but it is very welcome. When I put together the uh, Steam box, it's now being used as Nori's PC, but uh, when I put that together, I actually had to log in as the Steam user to a desktop session to enable that, and then I could resume and just have it set up as a proper uh, Steam yeah. big picture mode type of thing. Yeah, Val Val Valve has a big problem with UI inconsistency because, like, realistically, anything you should be able to do in desktop mode, you should be able to do in big picture mode and vice versa. We were yeah, running into this but problem that's not the case. To set up, <laughs> yeah, we were, trying to, we were trying to set up multiplayer games and in order to do this per controller Steam controller configuration stuff, you have to be in big picture mode, which is really mm -hmm. annoying because we're trying to play speedrunners or, um, or uh, Mortal Kombat or uh, Ultimate Chicken Horse, and yeah, it's just a pain in the ass to get that all up and running. Also, Strider has some weird Xbox DRV or not uh, XPad issues, so that might that might have also been yeah. causing it. Well, um, I mean, it's really good to see the Proton settings in big picture because hey, yeah. that is, I honestly think that like Steambox version two is going to be fuck it, we play everything. <laughs> and Maybe it'll be an actual yeah. Valve Steambox. This that's, time. that's the only way that's going to happen, sweetheart. Uh, Nobody's getting back in with the hardware. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Mm -mm. All right. So mm -hmm. we got to talk about it. it we'd be remiss if we didn't. It, so uh, it's, skip it's, ahead it's, for three minutes two... if you don't want to hear about that game. Yeah. So it's it's the two hundred it's the two hundred ton elephant in the room. Yeah. Uh. So rape day. It's a game where the guy's like, well, murder murder's been like uh, destigmatized. I want to do that with rape and not getting into the issues of why murder and rape are very different things and should be handled very differently in media. Um. This is basically just one giant PR stunt this guy was trying to do. He's like, oh, look mm -hmm. look at me. This is edgy. It's on Steam. I'm gonna get a lot of outrage and then I'm gonna use that to funnel people to buy my game. Um, and I mean, Steam, Steam has no reason to not allow this sort of behavior to happen because they remove games ad hoc. And as long as people are still giving them a hundred dollars a game, it, it does, it doesn't really, doesn't really matter to them. Right. If, if it, if it uh, drums up some controversy, they'll just delist the game and no, no skin off their back. Right. Yeah. <laughs> And with Valve's relatively lax approach w on what gets to be on Steam, I mean, you just pay a hundred bucks, uh, it's inevitable that people would try their luck with just about anything. And 
well, we had this. It's like, okay, I'll pay a hundred bucks and I'm going to put my game that's about, you know, murder, uh, rape, and just about everything else that's wrong with society. We're going to put that up there. And yeah, it wasn't until, you know, the bad press started coming in that Valve went, okay, we're not having that. It's something that made me step back and go, Valve, you know, you'll seriously need to fucking rethink your wait until public outrage policy. You can't have it both ways. You know you can. Quit pretending you can. The, oh, it's hands off until it can't be hands off. This is some bullshit shouldn't have shown up. All right. You know it. Yeah. I know it. The fucking entirety of the rest of everything knows it too. You fucked up mm -hmm. on that. Um, and the really sad thing is, is it made it through Steam Direct? Yeah. Somebody, I mean, I don't know. Because, like I said, Valve has no incentive to not do anything, to not do something, right? Um, yeah. They they'll they'll take the hundred dollars and they'll delist the game. No, doesn't matter. Yeah. And they seem content with only doing curation if enough of a fuss is raised. So we're going to see this happening a lot more. Uh, get right. ready. And, so, and, and yeah. it's going to get much, much worse. Much, much worse. Yeah. All right. Uh, what's up so, next? Speaking of Valve, uh, you know, uh, they had to let go of 13 employees. And a couple of them were uh, VR engineers. A couple of them, uh, well, a few more of them worked in the hardware uh, projects. And uh, the Team 3 Donkeys, uh, which was responsible for uh, Artifact, were also included in this particular uh round of uh, people being laid off which it's kind of a bad move considering that we've been hearing um over uh, like in the industry as a whole that people have been uh, getting laid off to keep profit margins up and whatnot and uh, yeah someone actually sent Gabe Newell an email and he replied this was a people thing uh so Whatever that means, we don't know. It's Valve. They don't owe any explanation to any public investors because they're a private company. They can basically do what they want with their employees. And as long as those people are, you know, getting, they can find a job doing whatever they want to do. That's great. That's cool. But, uh, Ved, you actually brought up a good point in the it's show. a couple notes. of things. <laughs> One of the big points I want to make is these were not contract workers. These were full-time Valve employees. Um, yeah, there were a couple of contract workers, but those were the three donkeys team. <laughs> you got to look at it like this is kind of like not just me, but a lot of people have been saying for the past couple of years and not throwing any shade on the technology. We got to go through these uh, steps. But, you know, I, I blame the face fucking toasters, the VR. Mm -hmm. it, it's not there yet. I mean, I don't know if it was necessarily ready to be productized. However, it could just be that. Maybe it wasn't really VR. Maybe we just now know how many people were on the artifact team. Question mark. Yeah. <laughs> I, I I mean, if 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 it is hardware engineers, I think it more has to do with the fact that Valve may have overestimated their ability to sort of pick up the HTC side of the equation when it came to the VR hardware. Um, that 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 could be another thing, right? They weren't prepared for the financial or technical burden, mm. um, because they. Yeah, that, 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 that's the real thing that happens. Companies bite off way yeah. more than they can chew. Well, I mean, um, even rolling with that topic, uh, with like Artifact, man, what was his name? Garfield. It's no longer Richard, yeah, Richard, Richard Garfield, Garfield creator yeah. of MTG. <laughs> that's kind of a big thing, though. But, I mean, this is more directly related to Artifact, though, isn't it? Uh, yeah. Yes. Uh, so, uh, um, Richard Garfield and Three Donkeys team were the gameplay designers. Uh, Richard Garfield does a lot of pure game design um and so yeah of, of course if you're gonna try and build a match gathering hearthstone competitor you probably want to get his input in on it um and based on based on this interview it doesn't seem like there are any hard feelings they came in to design a game they designed the game no one no one wanted to buy it mm -hmm. and so they gotta cease the relationship i mean it's a little sad because garfield's actually a really solid game designer and it looked like the at least mechanically i don't know about complexity wise but mechanically the artifact game seemed relatively sound but sometimes even the best design games don't resonate with folks or yeah. at least cause them to drop cash on booster packs this is true 100 percent. and you know and i'm not being mean at all not in the slightest but i genuinely honestly believe in the dark crevice where my heart should be that 
people who are interested in making games don't actively look for a job at all. That doesn't seem like logically no. where you would go to like even the people who show up there, we'd like to make a game. And then there's people that have been there for two decades. They're like, we've been trying to make a game. It just doesn't work <laughs> in a flat management structure. Yeah. So set, yeah, setting and, deadlines is important. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And we, it seems that with Artifact failing so hard and so quickly, it became apparent that some people were better off looking for work somewhere else. So yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if that was the case. <laughs> You're just angry because your dreams of VR artifact have been dashed. I don't have a VR headset. I don't want a VR headset. That's why he's it, so salty if you had a VR headset. No, no, no. See, see, see pay, pay true. I, know, I know as a TCG player in your heart of hearts, you want the IRL Yu-Gi-Oh shit where you can like play cards and holograms show up. At one point, I kind of wanted that. Nowadays, I think I'm over it. Okay. No, no. If, if 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 they had a good implementation of that, you'd be all over that shit. How about yeah, we get all if, over if the, it uh, was a really good implementation, then yeah, sure. How about <laughs> we get over the new version of Proton because it comes with thousands of new features. Oh yeah, it's a brand new <laughs> day for Proton. They hit the um, three sixteen eighteen is out. Um, yeah, they updated the DXVK to one Okay. Okay. Seriously. Uh, all right. Who else read this? Went to this web zone, looked at it, and said they didn't put any. Uh, oh. There it is. Yeah. yeah. I, I, <laughs> it's like, I, I, where I did, the release I notes? A a oh. <laughs> I, I, I mean, to be fair, okay. that's, it's, a, it's a fairly big chunk. And it, kudos on them for getting like a sub-week turnaround time on after uh, DXVK hitting a 1.0 and them pushing this update out. But This mm -hmm. is um, true. This is true. Um, that was it. I'm kind of on team. Like, wh why don't we get like wine 4 point something or another? Nah, yeah, they, they gotta re, yeah. They gotta re, they, they'd have to rebase all of their Steam input stuff. It's, it, I, I'm a little come eventually. I know. I'm expecting too much out of a scrappy little upstart like them. Um, mm -hmm. Listen, I they, mean, they don't. Who are these they don't set people? Deadlines. <laughs> they don't set deadlines, and so nothing gets done. Well, hey, this is the beautiful thing about Valve is, uh, hey, we're supporting Proton uh, for this week mm -hmm. too. That's that's good. They uh, they're still it. supporting it. They updated the XVK to 1.0, which, you know, uh, I finished, uh, like I mentioned at the top of the show, I finished Fallout 4. And if there's one thing that 316.8 did for Fallout 4 is it got rid of uh, the micro centering in most mm. places. There's, mm. It's still there. If you're looking for it, it's still there. But um, the really glaring ones, there, it's gone. So, yeah, good on them. <laughs> awesome. So, okay. winner, winner, chicken dinner. Game updates. Oh, yes. So, if you were paying attention on Friday, myself and uh, Ven uh, played a little bit of uh, Chicken Horse. Yeah. Jeez, really? And I'm, I'm trying to forget. <laughs> we also had uh, Foxy and Arthur and join us for that. And it was, uh, well, it was good. There was no weird crashing like the last time we tried it. Uh, the, I was also positively surprised that the DualShock 4, it just worked out of the box. And they even showed the little DualShock 4 drawing with all the controls and everything else. So that was really nice to see. Uh, they have uh, this update is mostly about skins oh my God, for they characters. Got a robot monkey. Yes, they have That's a robot so monkey. Yeah. They have. An axolotl. They, they, got they an axolotl. have a not robot bunny. <laughs> I, 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 I think I think a couple of these are alternate skins. The other the other big update here is um, they gave you the option to screw around with a lot of the core mechanics, like uh, how mm -hmm. many jumps you can do within a single jump, the height, uh, friction for wall jumps, and all sorts of weird things just to make your friends miserable. Um, actually, actually, uh, Strider Empty and I were playing a little bit of this uh, earlier in the week as well, and yeah, check it checks out. Yeah, it has new modifiers for just about everything that's a game mechanic. So if you really want to screw with people, you can. <laughs> if, if, you, if you want to take the Venstone Rocket League approach to Ultimate Chicken Horse, <laughs> they got your back. <laughs> it works, man. Uh, it was interesting because, like, not Friday, but the last time we tried to play that, it was just crashing to the point of laughter. Like, all right, mm -hmm. we give up. But we went back mm -hmm. and played, you know, even the custom levels. They, nope. they were just fine. <laughs> no issues. Yeah. So, I mean, good on them. Uh, and they've been updating. I, mean, I keep thinking it's an early access, but it's not. It's been released for yeah. a while. No, it, it, it's, it's out. 
Yeah. Yeah. We well, it's it's funny because we covered them when they're in Kickstarter, and they actually they're one of the few games that actually released. Right. Yeah. And a genuinely good game with online multiplayer support. Oh yes. Yeah. All right, uh, Pedro. Come on. It, it. Well, it's fast dust. It's been out for a while for Windows, but it's now available on Linux and Mac OS. And it's like, ooh, racing game for Linux and Mac OS. I, okay, I like let's have a look the at this. Tux Penguin, and then they have the Apple going to sue somebody. <laughs> <Mac> OS. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Apple can sue us for that. Uh, no, it's just, I went, to, it's like clicked on the store page button, and I went through, I looked at the video, and I looked at the screenshots. It's like, uh, don't judge a book by the cover, I guess, but it's very hard when the cover. You know, especially where Steam is concerned, has been very elucidating in the past. Uh, so you would rather I, just make assumptions about it? You couldn't be asked to download no, the free no, demo? No, 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 <laughs> no. There is a free demo. I didn't actually try it. I did send them an email. So if they, uh, well, I couldn't find their email. They have a contact form on their website. Uh, but it's, uh, it's yeah, it's off. like, okay. I mean, who would just have a contact form? They should have emails. <laughs> Right. Yeah, uh, we'll get to that in a couple of segments. Yeah, <laughs> but yeah, no, it the like the racing itself and the physics and the way that the cars collide and things that all looks fine. It's just everything else. It looks a bit drab. I don't know. Yeah, maybe it, it's just it, me. It kind of <laughs> it kind of looks just like a generic racing game. That was my only thought. Um, yeah. Mm. Yeah. I'm not against it. <laughs> Uh, twenty bucks. Oh, no, uh, more racing games. <laughs> I'd never heard about it. It's got uh, multiplayer and online multiplayer. So, mm -hmm. I mean, unless that shit's hidden behind like the built-in Unity matchmaking system, that could be interesting. In Which before, wouldn't surprise me. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, 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 Pedro just plays uh, all, right, all so... these pixel games that look like dog shit, and listening to them going, something's not pretty. <laughs> so, uh... <laughs> Uh, so, so, so G Gary has an update. Gary's yeah. got a thing, man. Rust, mm -hmm. uh, it, it's a game that was on Linux, then still technically is on Linux, just not supported. Uh, Caveman Penis, you might have remembered it, uh, from a while back. So many dicks. Vulcan in the middle. <laughs> they write, Linux and Mac were using a rather old version of OpenGL, you don't say. Um, so Force OpenGL no longer works. It's going to be using Vulcan and metal on Mac. Uh, that's kind of it until you try to do it is until it, is you it? download it then you try to play it and it i mean they have really dramatically increased the performance of this game even <laughs> on my ryzen 1700 with a 2060 at 1080p it was struggling to hit 60 in a lot of places and okay that's fun however now lightning lightning speed it crashes immediately to the desktop i mean i have not seen it move this fast in the history of ever however <laughs> however this is face punch studios kids so it is nigh impossible to know whether or not that results from incompetence or just trolling now you do get an error <laughs> with the foreseeing up. gfx device vulcan da -da 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 -da, shaders not be available basically that means they ship this without the vulcan back end it wasn't yeah, they didn't build the Linux backend for Vulkan. Kudos! <laughs> I mean, it's not... Yeah, you already mentioned it. It's not like they're pretending to support Linux anymore. They even removed the uh, the Linux or the Steam logo from the... Um, Steam OS logo from the store page. So, you know, Hanlon's Razor, never attribute to Malice, that which is adequately explained by stupidity. So I wouldn't be... You know, <laughs> entirely surprised if just someone just forgot. It's like, oh, we kind of need that. Oops. Mm. <laughs> I mean, I'm not, I'm not sure if that's what that error message even means, but... Um, According to oh, Unity's oh, oh, documentation, oh, oh. it does. Oh, what do we got? Oh, oh, shit. <laughs> Some chuggy chicken. Some chuggy chicken. All right. All right. Thank, Lovely. Thank, 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 thank you, Paul. Um... <laughs> I, 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 get, I get delivery service? There's a salad here? All right. No New games there. coming up. Deep Knot 6. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, this this is a game. It has cinematics like Final Fantasy VIII and gameplay like Final Fantasy VI. Final Fantasy VIII uh, so cinematics look uh, miles better than that. <laughs> I, 
<laughs> Listen, you have some fucking rose tinted glasses about Final Fantasy VIII, man. That looked like dog shit on the PlayStation. It just looked good for the time. But anyways, um, yeah, th this is a this is a JRPG sort of inspired by Final Fantasy, um, and they're, they're going so far as to steal a bunch of their aesthetics. Uh, there's no price announced. Um, so hopefully they don't shoot them in the shoot themselves in the foot with their gun blade and price it over ten bucks. Uh, but it's it's coming soon. I mean, I don't know. I mean, uh, it really does look like they've genuinely captured the PS One aesthetic. But I'm not necessarily saying that's a good thing. No, and I am kind of curious because uh, they, they do have the sexual content on the tags there, and since the game isn't out yet. That was the game developer that put that particular tag there. And there is a succubus-looking screenshot person uh, somewhere. So, and uh, your character actually is pondered uh, whether or not to take the uh, pennies with the uh, the hearts. So, this is clearly someone's fanfic. <laughs> Final fanfic scene? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, before we get out of so, here, so, uh, a little bit of character blindness with Deceiver, where you can launch your spider bros or your spider drones at walls, ceilings, enemy heads, and whatever, move and attack, and da 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 da. There's nothing about this game, but hey, man, it's not even available. It's just about yeah. for Linux. <laughs> I don't know. It's got online multiplayer, so maybe we can look forward to that. There's a demo. There is a demo. It's, appar <laughs> yeah, it's, it's apparently all done in. Uh, it's apparently all done in OpenGL, even window, even the Windows version. So that's a thing. Mm -hmm. Okay. It. I don't know. It. Maybe we'll try. Maybe we won't. I'm not 100. Yeah. percent Kind of like but, Tron. Like I said, I, a, a, a little, a little bit. Yeah. I, I'm always interested when, like, um, when when they start using OpenGL on Windows, right? Because. Hopefully that means that like you're not going to get any major performance hits when you when you get the Linux port. Either that or it's going to run like Universal Butt. Yeah, it's just going to run like crap everywhere. This is also the possibility. <laughs> yep. mm. All right. Well, yep. coming up next, uh, I introduce you to Isabel, and uh, we talk about the latest humble bundle and some rabbit food. All right. <laughs> Yay, I can make markers. I was like, oh, this is the part in the show when the plate fucking hit the table. Yeah, the first couple of episodes of uh, Project Binky had this song when uh, Richard Brunning says he's gonna get the funk out. <laughs> what are you talking about? Project Binky. It's a couple of guys from Shropshire. They're putting the engine and running box from a Celica GTR YouTube video. into a Got mini. Got it. See, we yes, can it's that. a YouTube series. YouTube video. <laughs> It's not, it's not, it's not just a series, it's not just a video, it's an entire series, it's, it's my series life. It's to me. It's my whole life. I subscribe and like. They've been doing it since 2014, so, so yeah. yeah. They're noobs. <laughs> You've been no, doing just a fabricating show everything. than that. <laughs> They've just been fabricating just about everything to get that, uh, to work. But yeah, no, it's actually really interesting, and they make it funny, so it's it's nice. <laughs> it wasn't my sexual content. I just pointed out what the uh, the tag said. <laughs> nope, all you. It's all your sexual content. I had I feel so for excluded from whatever the hell nice. is going on here. <laughs> they're plotting. They're plotting. I know it. My they're... paranoia is telling me that they're they're planning shit. 
see here's the little thing this was this is my the whole strategy and purpose of bringing everyone on after the news so they wouldn't be up to shit i'm like you guys get get to be on the show you don't have to run around in the background <laughs> yeah mm -hmm. that's what you think no the first one that walks in pick up the fucking chair right in the throat <laughs> And leave them there as an example to anyone else who thinks about walking in. <laughs> I'm just wondering how much fucking PCP's in that steak. <laughs> All I, of I it. Hope a lot. <laughs> Man, you think I want to be sober through this trip? Fuck that. Not for a second did I think you would be sober during this trip. Like. That never crossed my mind. Well, I mean, uh, Katana, you and I ran into each other um, on Thursday, yeah. I, I guess I guess you had the kid with you, yeah. Hey, hang hang around the Lutris booth. Oh, 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 oh. Um, what do you call it? The System Seventy Six guys had uh, Rocket. They had uh, Rocket League uh, at their booth, trying to convince Alan to uh, go crush some fools. See, Alan talks way too much mad smack <laughs> when playing Rocket League. He didn't want to have to cash that check, and he keeps his mic muted when he's playing against us in the aftershows. <laughs> he's just talking shit. Yeah, he does. Man, I guess to go for some PCP and lemon pepper. Couldn't we all? Yeah. Lemon pepper whips. That sounds like a YouTube parody video. What? <laughs> I cut down my usual nicotine dose to about half, and I'm going through this uh, 30 milliliter bottle for way too quickly. <laughs> I'll drink four. I'm trying to get off the thing. <laughs> oh, I'll drink four two liters before we're done live streaming. So, zero. <laughs> oh man, yeah, empty, is... empty destroyed a seven fifty mil Gatorade this morning. Oh, if you wake I up with a proper the fucking fridge. hangover, I turned around to get oh some... yeah. Oh no, there, 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 there is no hangover. This is just a man who is dehydrated. I turn, I turn around for a second, and he downs the entire thing. It's crazy. This is, this is how one rehydrates. I mean, I've done that to a power yeah. That's been my sole purpose for getting up. I'm like, oh, all right, two store. That's why you buy two, because the first one you don't even taste. Mm. That's why I like having uh, energy drinks. <laughs> Wake up in the morning, have an energy drink, it's like, ah, <laughs> so good. I don't. Yeah, oh yeah we, had, we, were, we were playing uh, Lotus Turbo Challenge 2 on an Amica emulator. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, is that just volunteered information, or did I miss something? No, I'm, 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 I'm responding to Katana. Uh, oh, okay, okay. Mm. I was going to be impressed if it was like, okay, <laughs> where's this going? I, didn't I, I, I just like to volunteer facts. Sometimes, man. <laughs> there was some bullshit a... fact I think a couple of days ago somebody told me. I was like, shit, try to remember that. So it didn't happen. <laughs> Damn shit. So Jordan, how many people walked up to you and uh, immediately recognized you and you didn't, you know, <laughs> they didn't have a presence in Discord or Chris, anyone else? Anyone else? Uh, Zero. Chris, Popey. <laughs> this um, many. He growled yeah, at them. Not, 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 not too many. <laughs> Which, on, on, honestly, I'm, I'm happy for. I, I, I don't want to, <laughs> I don't want to have to be that guy. It's like, be cool. Don't bog him. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, judging by the way you were looking standing next to Strider in that photo, you look like anybody. You basically, I was like, yeah, it's about how I fucking stand around trying to send off the, like, <laughs> don't bug me vibe. That's just, what, what was funny, too, is all throughout that interview, I, I was just like, okay, I'm not talking. I'm just going to stand still and not do anything dumb. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know. Sometimes if we're out and about, I'll smile and like, what doing that? I'm like, what? Smiling, quit smiling. I'm like, no. I'm like, it's creeping me out. Quit smiling. <laughs> <laughs> I 
What? what? You, you, you hating on my neck tube, North Ranger? Hey, man. That is the best neck tube. Yeah. It doesn't it actually... Me well, energized. It, dude, I mean, it looks like it's like LED RGB type lit up, but... Yeah, the this is, I think this is Strider's cable. It's got like little... It's got like little... Oh, it really LEDs does. I just thought it was power. blue. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's got LEDs running through it. <laughs> oh, da oh, damn. Oh, damn. <laughs> steak. Oh, there's steak happening. <laughs> yeah, on a gas grill. Pfft. You can call that steak. Listen, man, don't don't go don't go insulting Hank Hill and his livelihood. You might as well just cooked it in the microwave. Propane. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> that Some is whatever barbecue have, is like, in the Airbnb. Proper... <laughs> So microwaves have like proper grills. <laughs> Just pour some liquid grill? smoke on it, man. It'll be, it tastes yeah. the same. Cook it with a big lighter. <laughs> and some propane accessories. God damn it! Now I'm hungry again. Fuck! Did you just eat a cow? <laughs> No, I don't like. I have an itty bitty piece of chicken. <laughs> I just imagined it was like a chicken half. It's like it's just a fucking appetizer, man. This is bullshit. Bring me some food. Oh, what? what oh, oh, tricky steak. Tricky. Okay. Uh, somebody okay. took a bite out of it. <laughs> That's a really sad looking steak, if we're honest. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Thank you. That steak okay. definitely looks like it's had a dick or two in it. <laughs> I hope so. There's certainly a hole. <laughs> all, right, all, right, all right, hold on. Let, 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 me, let, me, let me give you the verdict. That's a, ooh, it's a little tough. <laughs> oh. Chop, 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 chop. No water. Do you have any water? Do you have anything to drink? <laughs> <laughs> it looks... Oh, well, I, I, I'm, I'm going to say he's going to say chewy. <laughs> He did put a big chunk in his mouth, so there's that. <laughs> this is how he feeds. I mean, he, he was kind <laughs> enough for the viewing audience not to unhinge his jaw. I mean, I got I got a big gristly piece, too, so there's a lot of fat I had to chew through. Um, it's all right. Mm. It's nice and pink on the inside. I'm not going to not eat it. <laughs> it's steak. <laughs> this is a, ladies and gentlemen, this is a valid survival strategy. I'm, I'm not gonna not eat it. There you go, Trugs. Highest praise, edible. <laughs> what did you, did you it not get any sauce? Literally not the worst. Um, it, I, you don't put sauce on steak. You should at least get some ketchup. The only sauce you can put on steak is a little bit of port wine as it's cooking. No, you don't put sugar water on fucking steak. <laughs> well, I'm, I mean, no, like, you, it, you it, take it, a little brush and you brush it over the top, then you flip it over and you brush the cooked side. No, 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 Pedro. What you do is if you if you're finishing your steak, uh, and a I, cast got iron skillet, you I got cast one. I got one. Cast iron skillet. No ketchup. I knew somebody was going to. Oh, go. Ketchup. <laughs> Um, but yeah, no, like, uh, you can scri scrape the fond off the, the skillet, throw in some, like, red wine, or white wine, do a little reduction, put on this over the steak. That's alright. A little bit of butter. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I use port wine because like, Portuguese. <laughs> because that's the only wine you have in Portugal. <laughs> it's not, but it's, you know, the one. <laughs> The Airbnb came with a bottle of Trader Joe's Merlot. <laughs> Two buck chuck, which is now three dollars, but yes. Oh no, more, more. I bought some sauce today. <laughs> I'm, I'm good, thanks. Yeah, yeah, it's good. Oh, uh, there better be some ketchup. I'm, I'm, pos I'm positive, Trugs. I don't. I'm, I'm, I'm good. The word downstairs. I don't know if it's, positive it's it's edible. <laughs> 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 oh, 
He's going to get something thrown at him before this is over. It's going to happen. Mm. I don't like my fucking steak, eh? <laughs> he he wants he wants to win that bet. <laughs> Mike, it looked like it lost. <laughs> yeah, no, it looks like the grill won that one. <laughs> Is that a, I think, actually, I think that's skirt steak. It's brisket. like super dense. You can risk it? I don't know. No. I call no anything brisket. that charred brisket. I'm like, you can't tell if you got it open. Come on. Well, yeah, you, you slow cook it until the shit disintegrates. <laughs> Yay, brisket. It just turns into ash. <laughs> Oh, that's right. I don't need the alarm to wake me up to go record Linux Gamecast because it's three hours ahead of time. <laughs> I'm already here. Yeah, I meant to ask you how's, that, how's that working out? Three hour adjustment. On, honest, so honestly, like I haven't been ta paying atten too much attention to clocks while I'm here. Well, true. So you're on holiday, and like I've I've been pretty ripped most of the time, so I'm just kind of on my own schedule. Right um, on. But I, when I get back, that's when it's gonna fucking hit me hard. Oh yeah, we 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 had a lovely little debate regarding what is a French mustard versus what is an English mustard versus what is the imitation of therein. French mustard has a little beret on, <laughs> and it's smoking. <laughs> and there's a baguette it's... on the label. <laughs> All right, um, let me go do a little bio break, then we'll get into the news. We'll, we'll see if we can get this run through. All right. Yes. I'm gonna keep eating the stick then. God damn it, Mike G, stop making me hungry. Mmm, <laughs> Pedro, wouldn't you like some of this? <laughs> I had steak for dinner and I'm hungry already, so sh just stop it. <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> you sure you don't want some? <laughs> All I have left is like turkey steaks. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how you can make steak out of a turkey, but you can get the turkey pretty fat. <laughs> yeah, I'll take you up on that, Mike G. I'll take you up on that. <laughs> Cause them sausages look good. Okay. Fuck you, listener. <laughs> ah, oh, there's actually a pub in Fullborn, just within walking distance from here, and it's... they make good steak. That's you ask medium rare and they bring it medium rare. It's 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 it's, it's good. Uh, you know what? I I hope when you go to a straight steak place and you order your steak, they do prepare it the way you tell them to. Otherwise, <laughs> I've been to a couple of pubs here where you ask for medium rare and it comes either raw or medium. <laughs> Raw's fine. I do like the uh, crispy bits on the outside, so yeah, medium rare. <laughs> you have a, you, you you smoke. You have a lighter. <laughs> yeah, no, I don't. I don't really smoke anymore. I just have this. <laughs> Pour some vape juice on there. <laughs> and it doesn't leave the house. <laughs> Did I stutter? <laughs> uh, and I'm yeah I'm, I'm I'm effectively trying to get down on the nicotine trying to get me off of it but yeah I'm just going through the vape juice like 
crazy. <laughs> Might I suggest heroin? <laughs> Way less addictive than nicotine. <laughs> Yeah, and get be addicted to heroin instead. <laughs> Listen, I'm not promoting anything, but like straight medical grade heroin, which is basically any opioid painkiller that you're getting a prescription for. Relatively fucking safe. I'm gonna tell you the prescription a then. <laughs> yeah, no, the strongest uh, painkiller they sell here is uh, paracetamol, 500 milligrams. Dude, I got like a lifetime subscription to like, uh, what is, is it, well, fuck you up, painkiller, man. But I can't help you. Vicodin? Percocet, I think? Oh, perks, yeah, perks, yeah, those, those will fuck you up. Seems that or Lord Tab or something like, I mean, I can get that anytime I want, but I can't hang with it. I just eat a bottle of aspirin every few days. <laughs> Yeah, no, I have that because, I don't know, I don't even remember the last time I took I don't really, yeah, the only drug I do is nicotine and alcohol, I guess. <laughs> no caffeine for you. Well, yeah, there, okay. I guess there is a bunch of caffeine in the uh, Earl Grey, <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> Right. Um, well, even my I've like switched even like my crystal light drink has caffeine in it now because <laughs> I found some with caffeine in it. I was like, why not? Yeah, the only caffeine, my only caffeine intake is just Earl Grey. Yeah, but coffee. I, uh, coffee, well, coffee, coffee. Either one, man. I mean, I go through fifty. Yeah, usually about forty, forty-five tea bags a day. So yeah. Okay, I don't have those many. I have like five. Well, I drink more than you. <laughs> Clearly. I'm well hydrated. That, that, that's a lot of tea. Not really. 45 tea bags? Yeah. Well, let's do like super strong tea. Let's... Two bags to an arch cup. And an arch cup's only good right. for like 10 minutes. So 25 arch cups a day. <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, if I get like a 30 pack of booze, I'll drink 15 in four hours, like while doing the show. <laughs> That's why I keep the booze away from me. <laughs> so I have to get up and go get it. That's how, you know, That's I keep getting myself up and in going check. and getting it, man. That's not putting a mini fridge. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Jordan, are you with us, buddy? I'm, I'm here. All right, is that how you're going to start the segment <laughs> off? Yes. <laughs> I'm not used to being in a chair, so I can lean back, but then crappy chair, so. All right. <clears throat> Three, two. And despite everything that's happening today, we still need to do a little bit of shilling for ourselves because, well, as it turns out, you lot are awesome, but we want more awesome people to, uh, you know, make this more, I more? guess. <laughs> yeah. We want more awesome people to give us more awesome money because it's all, awesome. All the awesome. <laughs> if, you, if, you, if, you, if you want to be one of those aforementioned people, you should head on over to uh, LinuxGameCast.com. Dagom. 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 Yeah. Um, yeah. We, we got we got all sorts of links you can click. Um, shit, I forgot which one we're doing next. Is it the store? Yes. Yes. No. Yes, it is the store. Yeah, we, we're giving we're giving a couple of the stickers out uh, here at scale. But if you want some of these for your own, or maybe you just want a Hell Elks mayonnaise shirt uh, or a coffee mug, you can go to our uh, Teespring and. Buy a bunch of those and cover your awful, awful shame. Here's uh, one of the things I really liked. I was seeing some pictures uh, from Scale, and one of the oh, yeah? pictures uh, Steve took, uh, Jill was talking to somebody, and the la lady next to Jill was clearly had the look of like, what the fuck's up with that t-shirt? Because it said how well it's on. <laughs> <laughs> and then I saw you and Strider at the Lutris booth, and I was like, God damn it, he's got a Francophile t-shirt on. It's like, all right. Yeah, he does. <laughs> he, he, he brought all the LGC t-shirts. 
<laughs> um, yeah, he, oh yeah, no, he, he it was great. He was mad at Jill this morning. He's like, I was supposed to wear the pink LGC shirt. <laughs> Yeah, and he's not. I know you're not joking. I'm. I'm. I, I'm absolutely not. This was a conversation we had a record. Hey, one of the Anyways, best ways I, if you want to kick us some coin is become a Patreon. We get some a uh, couple things you can uh, get with that, right, Jordan? Oh yeah, you get a lot of cool stuff like access to our Discord, where you can hang out with us and shit post all you want. Um, you can also get access to our show notes if you're uh, giving us two fifty a week. That's the Death Note level. Uh, and of course, the best thing you get from being a patron is the pre pre super shows and a special podcast that lets you look oh, behind look the veil of Linux oh, Gamecast. There it is. You're buying data bits. <laughs> I'm I'm <laughs> buying really really I'm buying really really spotty LTE is what and I'm you, buying. And you know what? You guys sent that picture upside down. So it fucking stayed upside down. Ah <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, there you are, Jules. <laughs> I'm sad they didn't get Strider's legs because he was he was grinding my crotch the entire time. It was great. Um, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we got empty. We got Strider. Yeah, you uh you you can check this out and see the entire travel photo booth at uh, on our Patreon. But you know what? You know what? We can also use a lot of hardware. This thing takes a lot to run. And so, if you want to be a cool folk, you can I go know. To Apparently, list. we need to put some funds on putting together a mobile rig. Appar hey, the mobile rig I had failed miserably. <laughs> so, you know what? Maybe, maybe it's time to invest in a backup one. Um, but yeah, you can go to our Amazon wish list, buy some stuff, end up on Frank's wall. That's Which you can barely see there. because it, he's hiding behind this giant monitor. And actually, that is one of the few things you can see in that entire yeah, shot. Right. <laughs> Uh, hey, we okay. got some people that we need to thank this week. Oh yeah, we do. Um, Gronk, Gronk Dalonka, uh, I was going to say Grongadonga, um, <laughs> is our brand new patron. Uh, Justin, who's in the house right now, we'll probably have him on later, uh, up to his place on Patreon. And, and, uh, George M. Uh, he's uh, giving us some money over the PayPal, which is a thing you can do it's, it's if you don't like yes. Patreon. <laughs> Hey, I know this Indeed. is going to be like another plug, but we need to talk about it. That is the latest Humbly Bundly 20. Yay! Everyone gets excited. Through our affiliate link. Yeah. Right. <laughs> what do we have? We have the first, but this is a Humble Bundle, so everything in, has a Linux port unless they made a new Gianna Sisters, uh, which they didn't. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We have the first tree, Tangle Deep Among the Sleep. Uh, pay more than the average for getting over it, Tooth and Tail. Not a bad game. Dream Daddy, that might be fun to stream, but oh yeah, here's the one that made me go, you fucking what? Um, <laughs> 10 what stinky caches for Hippitus Hoppitus from Wildfire, from the people behind the Humble Bundles. $10. Now, honestly, that's not a bad price for overgrowth, if we're being honest, because that's normally like, what, no, 30 that, bucks? That, what was it, like 30? Yeah, yeah so it's... 66% <laughs> off. That's that's better than what you can normally get it at. And I honestly thought about picking up a couple of copies for out of principle. I've been unable. And like you put your own game as the just, I, I don't like the way that smells, man. And you know, I'm not even worried about the fact that I'm smelling something over the, over the internet. <laughs> I, I mean, I, I to be fair, be you're paying show. 10 for overgrowth and everything else. And it, it is a humble indie bundle, so chances are, uh, once the first week elapses, they will have a couple of more games, usually from the previous bundle, they will add those in as well. So, I think it's fair. I have an extra key of overgrowth if anyone needs one. It's... Yeah. <laughs> oh, you know what? I, 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 I'll probably pick up Overgrowth for 10 bucks. I've been interested enough in trying out that game. I just want to pay 30 bucks for it. That's too much. Yeah. Too much. <laughs> Stay tuned next All week. Right. Okay. Uh, All right. I, KDE. I've, I've heard a lot of people tell me right to my face. Uh, you're a horrible person for running closed source and video drivers and open source all the things, but not not video games because I play a lot of closed source video games and I do some mental <laughs> gymnastics where that's different somehow because reasons. <laughs> because reasons. And uh, the fine folks at Kitty Digest, uh, they had, well, they had a bit of an article that said the easiest way to gaming almost entirely, in quotes, uh, or in uh, parentheses, painlessly on Linux, use AMD. 
And they, the article actually does a very good job of uh, saying, yeah, you you will have the best results with the, an RX 580 or an RX 480, something along those lines. And you need to use the Padock uh, PPA, the stable version, which is also the one that Feral recommends. So, yes, that is a very good advice. And it's... Um, yeah, no, that's just generally good advice for both AMD and Intel. Uh, if you're stuck on an Intel laptop for some reason, just use the Padaka stable PPA. If you're on Ubuntu, just do it. And it's, yeah, they say that it will mostly just work out of the box and uh, they make some bold claims like the uh, open source drivers are just as performant as the AMD GPU Pro module that you have, uh, which AMD still offers a proprietary module for the AMD drivers. It's... Yeah, it's a bit of a bold claim, though I do take issue with this article because, yeah, so if you're telling people that you need to set up a third-party PPA, you're literally one command away at that point from just a sudo apt install NVIDIA driver 418 in the NVIDIA settings, and it's just a different PPA that you need to enable. So it's disingenuous to say that AMD is the easiest when in the very same article you recommend that people enable so, that third so party repo my, <laughs> my counterpoint my counter is, point is that this is all a bunch of ubuntu nonsense in the rest of the world that in the rest of the world that uses real linux distributions um i mean if, you, if you're using a relatively recent uh distribution like a current snapshot arch or fedora and you have something like a 580 or a 480 or whatever you literally can just get up and running plugging and playing um yeah, but to, to to your point, yeah, you you are right in the sense that if you're going to be enabling third party repos on your distribution of choice, it's effectively the same step for getting. Yeah. Um, <laughs> for, yeah. I I I will say though, uh, developers are targeting against RadV and not AMD GPU, so there may actually be some better performance in RadV, uh, because you know that's actually getting attention and patches mm -hmm. and optimizations. And it makes sense. <laughs> well, you know, I'm yes. all for supporting Team Red, but yeah, don't be disingenuous with that. I mean, setting up AMD is arguably a bit more difficult than, because, like, even if you're dealing, especially if you're dealing with Ubuntu, you can get the proprietary driver out of the box. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 Uh, in, 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 in Fedora, I mean, yeah, they, they do, they do have the Negativo repos for the NVIDIA drivers. But I, I, like, like I said, if you, if you have, if you have an older card, definitely very, very painless experience. Uh, if you got the new hotness, like the Vega 7, or some of the Vega 64s, Vega 56s. Really, it's up to the distribution, right? If they're going to offer a yeah. version of Mesa or a kernel version that will give you that support. Mm -hmm. So, and if you're be if you're using Ubuntu, like the article seems to imply that you should, uh, especially KDE Neon in their case, it's uh, yeah, you really do want to have if you have AMD or Intel, you want to update those Mesa drivers, but it's not easier than getting an nvidia card up and running you just hate freedom pedro ma, ma, you ma, it clear. Mar marginally <laughs> I, I i would say it's marginally easier i, uh, I don't know <laughs> i also think a bit of education needs to be done because you know logic would dictate if somebody was coming off windows or even mac for that matter uh they got an amd card they would think oh i need to download the driver from amd and they would be wrong <laughs> Yes. A AMD yes. has proven yes, time and time again <laughs> they cannot write drivers. The AMD people are working with Mesa because they know how to write drivers. Well, mm -hmm. I would rock and roll with also, I, I was toying around with the idea of like, uh, maybe I want to play around with um, AMD, like in a 480 or something. And Strider, which is not technically inept, didn't have a good time out of the box with that, but he eventually got it set up and I was like, it might be an adventure for a different time. So, uh, mind test is it, it, dead. Hey, it, Long it, it, live it was mind a really test. good talking point at Stu. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, last week we got a bit of hate mail about Final Mind Test 5.0, which was a fork of this particular version of Mind Test that we're talking about right now. So, the major differences from version not. Point four point sixteen is that they changed the versioning number entirely, and now it's going to be uh, major, minor, and patch version numbers rather than zero, major, and minor. So, yeah, they also have other highlights, like they have an online content repository, so if you have 
mods like entire game packs built on top of mind test uh entire mod packs texture packs what have you uh you could get everything in one place which is nice very nice i don't know what the hell a carpathian map gen is but they have that too uh they uh did a couple of things to the mods and they also deprecated an outright broke compatibility with a bunch of things which i guess is what uh caused that split between this version of mind test and final mind tests because someone in discord last week actually mentions like yeah uh because uh mind test when they changed the 5.0 they included the wrong things and they um they what was it they didn't include the stuff that some people it wanted finally there was some he rambled drama. so long he forgot where he was going <laughs> <laughs> no, it, apparently Praise there was the even sun. some drama around it, and I, I, if anyone has a link to that whole drama thing that happened, I, I want that. There's just not enough people that. playing Mind Test for there to be drama. Apparently, there's there just is. enough people playing. No, no, no. There, there is just enough people playing Mind Test for there to be drama. Then okay. <laughs> I thought Microsoft made it better. <laughs> nah, they, they 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 made them rewrite it in C sharp, and that that was just a no go. <laughs> v- visual right. Minecraft. That's what we need. Yeah. What do we have up next. All right. All right. Um, Puppy Games. Uh, they released a little blog post that were saying that Basingstoke, their stealth game, is now free on Linux, and they're looking at making some other games free on Linux. And I, I my first thought was, okay, I guess their Linux sales peter out, so they figured they'd just try to get in as many people's hands. But then I read the blog post because you should read articles before commenting on them. And um, they're saying that they want to move a lot of their development over to their Patreon, uh, which I think is actually mm-hmm. a fairly decent uh, uh, early access development model. Because, yeah. you know, you, you're, you're forced to deliver, and if you don't, people stop giving you money. Um, and yeah, um, it's, it, 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 it seems like, yeah, they're, 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 try, they're trying to get some goodwill with the Linux community. Uh, they're trying to get the game out there so that people are aware of them so that they'll send the money over over Patreon. And yeah, I, I guess I was just a little overly cynical at the beginning, but I think that this is a very interesting move and I'm curious to see how it plays out for these folks. Hmm. Yeah, and it's really great to see. They do have a pay what you want if you go to the itch page to download the game. You can just say no, just take me to the downloads. But they do have a little uh, pay what you want. So if you do want to send them some cash to, you know, reward a very good move for bringing the game out to everyone on Linux for the freeze... You're very welcome to do so. Uh, I did run into a bit of a bug because I tried it out. It's like, oh, it's like um, it's got rogue-ish elements uh, in the survival genre. And it's like, okay, I like roguelikes, so I'll give it a I'll take it out for a spin. But there's a wallet item that you can use to save the game at any point. You just use the item. It'll be saved where you were supposedly but when you actually reload the game uh you go to the nether realm because the screen is all pitch black and your money is uh always increasing so what's the money clipped the left side of my screen because it usually starts on the uh, top right i went okay we're done and yeah no there's a bit of a bug there i want to fix that <laughs> well hey man good on them you got to try stuff too and Show them some love. Yeah. Go download it. Let them know what you think. Before if we you, get if out you of like here, it, go to their Patreon. Do need to talk yep. about Cytopia. No description, website, or topics provided. And I'm really tempted to be like, up next. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's a free open source retro pixel art city building game with a big focus on mods. It's based on custom isometric rendering engine based on SDL2, so you know it's going to work. I think it looks kind of neat. Think of like Hipster Pixel Sim City. And I mean, outside of the Hipster Pixel thing, uh, could be kind of fun to play around with, right? Maybe? Yeah. Yeah. Especially if you're like into making mods for stuff. Like you're saying, like, hey, here's a game. Go mod it. Go nuts. Make crazy stuff for it. Mm-hmm. So maybe maybe we'll get some crazy Godzilla mods for uh, Cytopia. <laughs> And it's actually simple. have like a SimCity style of game built completely um, off of this particular engine. That would be very nice. Mm-hmm. No, I think it's neat. Uh, there is a dev package available, which basically means you can make it run on anything. Just unpack it with Archiver and yeah, yeah, <laughs> give it the double clicks, and it'll be a thing. 
didn't get a chance to try it, but it's something I might play around with. It, didn't they... We, we need, like, a uh, multiplayer SimCity. Yeah, I tried that. <laughs> okay, what we need is um, asymmetrical well SimCity so somebody sim can be the monster. Oh, uh, okay. I see. Oh, that, 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 would, that would actually be a really cool asynchronous game where, like, one, one, one uh, for one player, it's a city builder like Sim City, and for the other person, it's Rampage. Yeah. <laughs> Me, I, I want to be the crushing debt. Mm. I, I want to be the crumbling, the crumbling infrastructure that no one wants to pay to rebuild. Be quiet, America. I want to play the tsunami, <laughs> <laughs> the poop tsunami, and on that bombshell. The Poonami? Yes. Coming up next. No chair acquisition this week. I'm going to go downstairs, get some people, and I'm going to have them sit in this chair and talk about scale so that I can eat a steak. Mm. Another steak. <laughs> My blood pressure. No. <laughs> My fragile blood pressure. Bud. <laughs> Uh, good times. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go. Uh, I'm gonna go scoop up some people and bring them up here. I guess. All right. Mm. Hmm. Hmm. So, oh. what's new with you, girlfriend? Uh, nothing. <laughs> I don't know. You I feel dead air on your own. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm very good at staying quiet. It's 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 my mo throughout most of the day. It's it's what I do. But yeah, no. It's um. Pedro's still at the I'm point totally... of his life where he thinks like the people at work count as socializing. Yes. <laughs> I've been there. <laughs> that I, is I my mean, socializing. <laughs> I I speak from experience. <laughs> that is my uh my social quota is usually work yeah <laughs> no i'm totally buying that uh turbo metallic red brushed aluminum um microwave mm -hmm. that's uh yeah <laughs> that's going to be my purchase for the month <laughs> I'm. I don't know, I didn't really want anything. Uh, I was talking to you yesterday. Um, I'm really tempted about buying one of these fucking monitors for me. Mm hmm. <laughs> this is company property. There needs to be one that's been property that's not in here. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this is bigger than my fucking TV. I could. I'm in the process of. Justifying the expenditure mentally. I don't have anything else to spend money on, so. Yeah, no, that TV that uh, Nathan just uh, extended loan to me, it's uh, 49 inches. Uh, Nori is the one who uses that. She just has uh, the monitor that I got her. Uh, it's secondhand off eBay. It's a Dell. It had really thin bezels and really good IPS rating, mm -hmm. and. It's got like 99% RGB3, so it's pretty good. And it was second hand, so it's like a hundred pounds. Like, yeah, give me. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Uh, and she was like, oh, there's two HDMI plugs in the back. Yes. Can I plug in the TV? Yes. Okay. Yeah. And she just uses the monitor and the TV. <laughs> I will say the one thing about this, I was, which I didn't intend. Like, I was hoping the floor stand would be here, but I at least had to try it uh, to be on the desk. I was worried about the screen door effect being so fucking close to it. Yeah. Nope. I mean, it is, yeah, it is UHD, so. <laughs> it's like, oh, this is great for your fucking posture, too, because if you want to look where you're at, like, <laughs> you have to look up. And I'm like, oh, you know, this is probably beneficial. Then you just... <laughs> It's completely unmaintainable. Plus, I was kind of mm -hmm. oh, really hoping. I just thought it might be interesting because I had to do like load calculation on the desk because it's glass. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah. It, it, it's, oh, man, no, that... It's utilizing half of load capacity that it has. <laughs> oh, man, oh, man. So... Uh, I went down to get some people. I was drinking some water. Um, appar apparently, um, apparently, Empty called the VLC guys wearing the VLC traffic cone hats the safety wizard, and they didn't appreciate that. I did a spit take on Jill when I heard that. So, <laughs> <laughs> so now Jill's angry at you. <laughs> yeah, I was, I, was drinking, I was drinking some water. Empty's telling me the story, and I'm just like... <laughs> safety wizards. Safety, safety wizard. Bangs the chest. <laughs> Oh, man, yeah, so they're, they're, they're going to come up in a minute or so. All right. Okay, then I'm going to go take Right, a folks, because I know you're Get watching beer, downstairs. Right Latency aside. <laughs> oh, I can't stand it. There's like 10 seconds of latency. I know. Right. I, I was almost able to catch myself leaving the room, though. That was pretty good. Nice. Yeah. Ugh. I cannot do uh, picture uh, tubes anymore. Well, he tried to communicate. Uh, safety wizard is too good. Safety wizard. Safety wizard. It's a fucking traffic cone for VLC. Uh, good times. I forgot to switch my laptop over to California time, so I just looked at my PC, looked at my clock, I'm like, that's not right. Yeah, it's a safety yeah. wizard. Yeah! Safety wizard. Wizard starfish. <laughs> wizard starfish. Let's chop him up, see if he grow another one. Did... I'm trying to remember if I've ever acquired a traffic cone from dubious sources like the side of a <laughs> you road. You mean the street? Yeah. Yeah. That might have happened in my youth. It sounds awfully Maybe. familiar. Let me each. Seems legit. Yeah. I'm getting more X runs than normal. I have to play around with this. No. I still. Yeah. Yeah. I'm dialing it in. Yeah. I was, I was going to say. I didn't have the exact verbiage to specif specifically describe what you were doing, so I gave up. Yeah, you, you gotta reconfuble the what's it Motron. Pretty much. Yeah. Uh but I had to see what how it was going to handle multi track recording with like two automation tracks and it's like I don't like this. Not at this setting. Right. You say that to all the monitors, Pennywise. It doesn't matter. The OS of today is the bootloader of tomorrow. That sounds about right. I got a 90 day warranty. Oh yeah? Yeah. Certified re Oh, this is the other thing about buying one of these. If you buy one, you pretty much want to go out of your way to get a certified refurbished one. Because oh, yeah? they all shipped with an issue with their firmware. If you hook up DisplayPort, they randomly blank. Oof. And the only way to fix that is to send it back to the factory. That's the only way to reflash the firmware or update it. Ah, uh, that, that, that makes sense. Yeah. And they, they just do that as part of the refurb process. Right. So if you go to Newegg, like where you can buy these new, that is all the reviews yep. are. Every fucking review is like, it's got this issue. This sucks. I had to send it back. Mm. And then they fix it and then you get it for cheap. Everybody wins. Yep. Especially Newegg who gets to get their fee twice. Oh, 31.5. Peasant. <clears throat> hmm. 
This wool is not particularly hydrophobic. <laughs> Good to know. <laughs> Most of the time I'm wearing polyester shirts, man, so it's just like mm. just drips to the ground. I don't know. It's still like this fucking ghetto quill <laughs> ballpoint pen tape to it. Man, somebody was like I, I respect that because it's commitment. Because they could have just had it in there in the holder. No one would have been like, yeah, but like, no, this needs to function. Well, I can <laughs> consider that this is also a little girl's room and uh, follows little girl logic. You hope it's a little girl's room. <laughs> may may maybe, maybe it's a 42 year old man named Isabel. Assumptions are being made. <laughs> yep. This is this, this this is true. I shouldn't assume. But I'm also really high right now, so... Really? No. <laughs> I'm... A little, little bit. <laughs> Just a little bit. It's not... Not, not gonna say... I, 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 oh. No, I had a little nip of the jilly dog before I came up here. Well, have fun with that, Internet. Uh, yeah? Pedro, I see that your blood sugar's crashed. <laughs> No, I'm just fucking hungry. Because <laughs> of all the steak earlier. <laughs> I know. Uh, Watching well, people eat steak is the gives me a dangerous craving for... Uh, what the fuck are you eating? Um, uh, that's Kinder Bueno. It's just chocolate. Chocolate. <laughs> it's got enough calories that my stomach goes, Okay. We're good. <laughs> Emp empty, empty calories. Are we gonna get some fucking people up here? <laughs> I'm waiting. Hello, people watching downstairs. Come upstairs in 10. No, five, I want to watch the show. Keep doing show. <laughs> yeah, okay, well, there, there's one. Who, 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 who else is coming up? Well, I knew Joe would be up here. <laughs> of course, Joe. Of course, Joe's coming up. Why well, we, we had to chase her off so you could sit back down. <laughs> I, well, yeah, I was just, uh, well, well, we got, we got, we got. Oh, we, we got, we got camera Gandalf. Yes. <laughs> we got, we got Steve, Steven, Steven, Nicole. No, we can do without him. Bring some notes in. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Justin, oh, wow. that's horrifying. Uh, I know. <laughs> now kiss all of you. <laughs> Make oh, out. Oh, <laughs> oh, Orgy. Oh, obviously. Go away, Isabel. All oh, on the bed. Everyone on the bed. Ladies and gentlemen, right. everyone at home, if you're wondering, um, I just wanted to see what the load capacity for that room was, considering it's upstairs, because <laughs> I'm an evil human being. Now we know. And the rest are downstairs having jilly dog. Well, in the... <laughs> yeah, every, every, everyone else is just smoking weed. I wish I was one of them. <laughs> and the one responsible for getting us all together. Drugs, drugs, get, 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 get your ginger butt in here. Drugs, drugs, drugs. Ladies and okay. gentlemen, boys and girls, <laughs> technically, that Man. shit, every, uh, all of that, he's all that, stubbly. Gross. All of that, <laughs> all of that is technically my fault <laughs> it is entirely your fault then stone do you started this <laughs> well, I, I i guess i could put it on the crappy room speakers well we'll see if no uh, no no we can take no. turns we can swap out the air okay <laughs> yeah all right we'll do that. Well, steve's we'll trying to that. communicate somebody hit him <laughs> just lay him out i, I think Fuck steve, him up. Are, are you describing like a dildo you're like I don't know. All I can see is you gesticulating in the background in a little tiny window over there. I was, I was trying to help Shill for an Acer there. Oh. <laughs> oh man, how much is Acer paying you? How much? How much is Acer? This show paying brought you? to you by. Yes. You see, this would hold water if there was another one. Right. Do you hear me, Acer? <laughs> right. Just, yeah, well, well, every, everything's just Acer. Ven's wearing an Acer shirt. Oh fuck yeah, Acer jumps. I got yeah, an Acer no, tracks. Yeah. For, for, oh yeah, no, no. The the the, the fuck wall <laughs> is just replaced with an Acer poster. I'm sorry, yes. I can't hear you. Um, over this fine, fine Chromebook provided by the folks at Acer. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it wasn't. It's 250 pounds of my own. 
I, this is great. None of these people can hear you, so. I'm going to surrender the chair. Spider, go, go ahead. I can hear you. I actually prepared for this by hooking up my small Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah, the, there's the LGC live in the Discord, so everyone should be using that. <laughs> I, I, All right, so what's going on tonight? I don't know. He just told you to sit down. I didn't give him any instructions. <laughs> he fucking bailed on well, you, man. Well, now I'm repeating <laughs> It just puts you in the hot spot, or the hot seat, or not really the hot something. <laughs> Tell Jordan to um, sit his ass back down so we can do this. Well, <laughs> talk about the marvelous interview you had with Noah. Hey Strider, I'm going to send a very painful audio signal to you, or you can tell Jordan to sit his ass back down. <laughs> Pick one. Um, what, what, let's not break what will be the DLG segment about? I mean, what uh, can I do it? Can I can I ruin it? Yeah, just mute the channel until they figure it out. How about that, Pedro? <laughs> I don't think that works, honestly. <laughs> I don't know. I'm having a good time with it. <laughs> I'm, I'm feeling we're getting things accomplished. I mean, I just have Strider looking mildly confused at the camera. And Steve tell? looking very confused at the camera. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Alright, so if you want Jordan back, then... I was going to say that right in the... I, I, I mean, don't you want to keep Strider? He's way more handsome than I am. <laughs> See, I, I'm bored at this point. Would you put him? I'm so confused. Aren't we all just a little bit? Oh, oh yeah, we got we got some Mexican beers. All right. Mo Mo Modelo Especial. <sighs> so. So. All right. Whatever that just was. Let's not do that again. Sure. Okay. So what do you want to do then? No, I mean like the slamming on the table or whatever the fuck that was. <laughs> no. Sure, that. <laughs> I think that was just Strider picking up a beer bottle. Yeah. Just make sure everyone's conscious of, like, that transmits directly. Okay, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we can just rotate them in. I'm, we're just going to ask them okay. whatever's going on. I think everyone has a mobile phone or somebody. Is, is there, like, a community uh, mobile phone? Yeah, can... empty, empty has the Discord uh, going on his phone. Okay, good, good, uh, good. The, the voice room, yeah, yeah. Oh, let's do this. Is it working? Yeah, it is. It claims it is. We'll find out. <laughs> and... Do, do we want to... Nope, want that's to not going to work. Part? We should we Oh, <laughs> I know what we could do. That'll the actually... scale pictures? Yeah. Should I get should I get a banana? You are a banana. <laughs> <laughs> and be quiet, banana. No, scale seventeen banana. X. Sixteen, seventeen. There we go. We can I will have to do a little surgery on the shot. But give me a moment and we can run mm -hmm. through the photo. Ah. Hmm. R. <laughs> yeah. Science. <laughs> All right. Oh, chairs at the photo gallery. Yeah, or <laughs> throw chairs at the photo gallery, Empty says. <laughs> Your wish is my... Boom, 
here's the chair. In three, <laughs> two, wow. just open us up, Jordan. Give us some idea of what we're doing, baby. All right. Well, um, I flew out to California, as y'all know, because I'm in a very pink room and I have uh, Jill in the background here, uh, to go to go uh, experience the wonders and horrors that is the SoCal Linux Expo. Uh, we had, we set up uh, we had two booths. We had uh, the Linux Chicxulub booth and the Lutris slash sort of one eight per, eight percent LGC booth. Um, and yeah, uh, I guess uh, we're gonna talk a little bit about what was going on. We got a lovely little picture album here. And some folks are going to rotate in and give some commentary. And Alan's going to film the reverse so you can see all of the backs of our heads. Um, <laughs> all right. So, so yeah. Um, yeah, so uh, hanging out at the Lutris booth was... Uh, I mean, where, where should we get started? Should we go from the beginning of time when I arrived or when Truggy arrived? Sure, uh, why not? Do it. Bring it. Uh, yeah. All right, all right yeah. So, <laughs> so Truggy got there a couple hours before I did. Uh, they picked him up. Um then they picked me up. We went to the si they went they went to a burger place, and then they picked me up and went. We went to the same burger place, which was pretty good. Um, then I crashed at Strider's house. Uh, smoked a lot of drugs and played a lot of video games, so that was fun. <laughs> um, and, and uh, yeah. Um, then then the convention proper. Uh, we we um actually uh one cool thing was I ran into one of the maintainers for Open Morrowind. Nice. Um, <laughs> yeah. They um they they came by asking about Lutris and I'm like hey so we're talking about engine reimplementation you know about Open World Morwin oh yeah I'm one of their maintainers so I actually got his email address so I'm gonna try to try and get in contact with them afterwards and see if we can get him on the show that would nice. Be cool. nice 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 um went to a couple um yeah the the rest of it is just chilling hanging out with Chris and Popey and these guys um yeah we were we were showing off a bit of what Lutris is capable of showing uh the god version of um uh not raven's cry i'm gonna <laughs> right now uh, witcher the witcher 3 um we, we also played a little bit of doom we had some amiga emulators going on um we were we were we were not quite the only gaming folks there uh the system 76 guy set up some rocket league and i think the um uh, the mary db guys were giving away an nes classic so they set up like donkey kong at their uh, at their table but okay. um, but yeah yeah went went to some talks of very beginner friendly Godot talk and something about uh, zero mesh uh, zero zero trust networking that was a little it was it was it was interesting I I got some I got some cool ideas to possibly implement. Well, I heard that um, your um, yeah. talk uh, the Godot talk was kind of like uh, <laughs> different, so, not like bad. That, that, so so the 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 talk was called Godot or Get Out, um, and. It was, it was I, and I expected, like, maybe it was some Godot contributors who were going to talk a bit about the project. But what it happened to be was it was uh, three high school students who uh, made a video game using Godot. Um, they did all the, sp the sprites themselves. They wrote all the code in GDScript. And they were talking a bit about their experience. Um, it, was very, it, was, it was very beginner friendly. Although I did ask him at the end, hey, did you develop this under Linux? No, we developed it under Windows. Sad. <laughs> Then you threw him um, into traffic. Understood. As a tradition. Yeah. Yeah. And then, then, Don't then, get then angry, people. I mean, it's a Canadian custom. He has to honor his yeah, traditions. It, indeed. And there are no hang, moose around, with, uh... so traffic it is. Well, he bit him first. I no, mean, he's, no, he's no, 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 no moose. Lot, lots of meth heads, though. Meth head Charlie. Method. Not in LA. Him, right. him and his voguing. So, Jordan, who's our and, first and, victim? And his open sores on his face. So um, I guess I guess uh, Jill has some stuff she wants to say. She's been she's been working her ass off for the past right. couple of days running the Linux Chicks booth. So she gets my gross head to phones. All right. <laughs> All right, Jill. What's going on? You got five minutes. Go. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so um, I've been uh, doing lots of interviewing on the floor for LGC and LWW. So I've interviewed uh, interviewed Popey and um, Emma from System76 and um, uh, uh, Krita and Inkscape. I'm going to be interviewing GitLab tomorrow and uh, some other smaller projects, uh, developers from other smaller projects that I'm, you know, really have passion about. So and just, also, are you just like walking up, like throwing your mic on the floor and going, do you know who I am? Yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> so I usually, what I've been doing is um, 
I go up and I tell them about my show. They don't already know. And most of everyone there already knows. So, and they're happy to be interviewed for LWW. And then I make sure to, to tell them I'm going to, I do a little interview on the, on a, a nice interview on the floor. And then I give them my business card and, and say, we went you on the show proper, uh, a live, live interview. And they've all said yes. <laughs> okay. So all that's right. really mm-hmm. awesome. Yeah. So we can all interview them together. And um, uh, the other thing I'm doing in between interviewing everyone is uh, working the Linux Chicks LA booth. And it's been wonderful. We've gotten, uh, we, we have, our project was, a, it's a Raspberry Pi photo booth. Um, we created a Raspberry Pi photo booth, essentially. And um, people can, the community can go up and take pictures of themselves with giant inflatable penguins or uh, penguin masks. And um, all the families and kids. So you got like a little RNG, like every third or fourth picture, you just put some spooky shit behind there to fuck with them. Yes, (laughs) yes, we've done a lot of that. Yes, and we've done photo bombs with, with the Linux Game Cast crew. And that was a lot of fun. And uh, yeah, so it, that was really neat. And not only what, what's really cool about it is the software we're using, um, um, we set up a, a printer on it. So it actually prints a old fashioned picture like it would, you would have at a real photo booth in the carnival. You should have went old school. <laughs> you should have like dug out like a USB dot matrix printer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes, that would have been really cool. <laughs> so did you guys have fun? Everything Definitely. worked smooth. Uh we followed yes. as you were going through picking everybody up. We we have some pictures there for you watching the uh mm-hmm. Yes, yes. Oh, we're gonna have uh, probably a thousand pictures by the time we're done. That's uh Treggy arriving in LA on Monday, and then we had uh Jordan's aw- arrival, and that was amazing. And we took him around Los Angeles. We went to SpaceX and um, down to the beach near where I live and uh, took him out to a lot of good Mexican restaurants. Because <laughs> <laughs> I know that's something they, they, both, they both don't have here. And, uh, and then Empty arrived on Wednesday. Um, he had been at scale and joined us last year, and that was so exciting. So I was so happy to have Empty back. He's amazing. And it's just been so cool meeting the LGC um, co-host who I work with every week now on the shows, just meeting them in person. It's just been really wonderful. <laughs> and one of my highlights is uh, having uh, Jordan in my studio, <laughs> so I have my broadcasting studio. So that was really cool. <laughs> and I'm so busy, you know, at scale doing the interviewing and doing the Linux Chicks booth, I'm literally, you know, bouncing back and forth um, uh, that I don't have time to go to the talks. But the beauty of scale is that um, everything is recorded on YouTube. In fact, they've already uploaded um, several several days worth of videos on YouTube. So I spend several months after scale watching all the vid- videos of all the talks I wanted to see. And it was amazing. Okay. On Saturday, there were 16 tracks. That was just, it, it's huge. <laughs> it's just amazing. <laughs> and um, so I'm looking forward to listening, you know, going through all those those videos. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> Pretty sweet. And still nice. more to come. All right. We need our next yes. victim. Who do we have? Yes, we do. Um, uh, Nicole, would you like to speak? Uh <laughs> <laughs> No one's no one's waiting to speak. <laughs> Everyone got asleep. bored no, and walked away. Go, empty. There's there, empty. Empty's turn. Okay, how does this thing even work? You put them in your ears. You put both of them in to, to hear pretty well. So. All right. Okay. What's up? Can you say something? No. Hello. I'm Hello? Not saying anything. <laughs> no. <laughs> You're hearing shit again. It's too late. <laughs> the voice is in your head. <laughs> One Michael Tehan, ladies and gentlemen, this is not his first trip to scale. Nay, this is his second. You showed up. How did it go? What did you see? What terrified you? What turned you on a little bit? Well, the nice part is like, I'm on vacation right now and I got an exhibitor pass, but I don't really have a booth. Uh-huh. I'm just <laughs> floating around, checking everything out. You know, I hung out at the Lutris booth a lot, but 
at the same time, there were so many great talks just on so many, like, on everything. The security track was particularly um, interesting. This year. Security track? Other than that, I've, yeah, they have, like, eight different, eight different tracks, ten different tracks of talks going on all at the same time. So there's absolutely no way to see everything. So what did you guys say yeah, about the uh, yeah. Lutris booth? <laughs> Well, it was kind of disappointing that they only did The Witcher 3 the whole time. I was like, Matthew, <laughs> something, anything. Dude, but... they should have played well... Deus Ex with Lutris to show off Linux gaming. <laughs> it's, it's pretty bad, actually. Some guy some guy who knew what was in the cutscene at the beginning of The Witcher 3 quit out of our save game and started a new game mm. so that he got the opening <laughs> intro movie going again. We were just like, oh, I hope no one comes by right now. Lovely. Oh, this is bad. <laughs> <laughs> but then we put on doom and killed some demons and that was good so you know all right it seems like it's working out pretty well the the, the the house idea here is probably the best thing we've we've come up with yet that was a genius move on whoever came up with the ideas part that's probably better than so you, <laughs> you've basically uh started uh taking over uh strider's place at this point well, uh <laughs> Strider's place is far too small for the number of people we have here. Uh, so we got this house in Pasadena. It's like maybe 10 minutes from the convention center instead of, you know, a 45-minute slog through traffic. All right. And okay. It's cheaper than a hotel. I think we, I think we had 11 people in here. Was that, is that the right number? 11, 12. 11, 12, something like that. That's, that's pretty good for a house. So anyways. So there's a significant and, amount uh, of you all there. Nice. <laughs> Yeah, I can uh, smell it from here. Yes, actually. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm going to pass this along, and uh, I know we got Justin here, so um, good chatting with you, fellas. Go. Yeah. <laughs> ah, Mac Geek. <laughs> See, he's not an audiophile. <laughs> no, no, no. He's both angered and confused hey, by earbuds. <laughs> hey, what's going on, Justin? So, hey, uh, Pedro, how are you guys doing? Horrible. Hello. It's miserable. You're looking the wrong way. My bad. My bad. <laughs> Don't worry about it. The people listening in audio won't know, but they do now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> how far did you drive? You you came down from a moment, didn't you, upstate? Yeah, um, 740 miles, 13 hours, doing it again at 10 a.m. tomorrow morning. Ooh, <laughs> okay, that's a bit of a weekend. <laughs> It was so worth it. Scale is awesome. Everyone here is awesome. I had four job interviews at Scale yesterday. So okay, that's me, pretty good. IBM, IBM interviewed me. Um, I had dinner with the whole System Seventy Six crew, which was pretty awesome. So yeah, pretty good. Did you see anything so interesting, they, exciting, terrifying, mesmerizing? Um. The whole event was terrifying because I felt like I was the only uh, Windows sysadmin in the entire room. Oh, I highly doubt that. <laughs> yeah, there was probably a couple of more hanging around. That That's a vacation yeah, was... for a Windows sysadmin. They're like, ah. Oh. <laughs> it felt like a vacation. Um, I currently have around 200 work emails, so uh, that will be my Monday, digging through emails. That sounds pretty sweet. Uh, you going to come back next year? I'm going to drag the wife down next year. Even if she doesn't want to come, she's coming. <laughs> that sounds okay. like a brilliant idea. Make sure you film it. Um, <laughs> or, you know, better yet, have her film it. <laughs> <laughs> well, my wife's a uh, level two black belt in Krama Ga, so it might not end well for me. Maybe. So. <laughs> Maybe not. I don't know. I got a little faith in you, man. You might be, might be able to watch mm -hmm. around. All right. That's cool. Who do we yeah. got up next? Someone. Who knows? <laughs> Take care, guys. Someone is coming. <laughs> ha. <laughs> I knew by process of elimination I'd get ah. to Alan. <laughs> Not that one. No, the nasty ones. <laughs> Someone tell Alan it's the Bluetooth ones. <laughs> This is all an elaborate <laughs> joke to give everyone an ear infection. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, we did it. We got him to put him in his ears. That's so nasty. Yep. 
Gross. <laughs> oh. <laughs> ah, intermingling earwax. So, Alan, how was scale for you? Oh, it's been going crazy. Uh, you've been working the camera. You've basically been uh, Mr. Meta instead of Mr. Alert, as usual, because you've been filming the camera that's been, you know, recording the show the whole time. So, <laughs> what do yeah. you got a problem with people who like to watch, Pedro? I can I can relate to the voyeuristic tendencies, no, it's not, but no, uh, <laughs> no, Pedro, it's not even the voyeuristic thing. If you're used to watching the show, sometimes being there in person is a little too real. If you're watching it through the LCD, it's more like watching the show. Yeah, okay. All right. <laughs> so, uh, from all the footage that you managed to get uh, thus far, which one was uh, the one you enjoyed the most? Yes, which Alan? one footage? Yes. Uh, <laughs> like, interview, situation, I'll anything. Probably the uh, interview outtake with uh, Jill and Jordan. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Go on, share the deets. Nope. <laughs> Uh, well, uh, uh, Jordan or Jill uh, mispronounced Jordan's last name and he just <laughs> stuffed and went off. Ah, uh, yes, Swing Cock Smasher. I mean, it's practically prime. Yeah. <laughs> so, how many more days of scale, man? Uh, we just have uh, one more day tomorrow. One day? Is there anything like big going no. on tomorrow? Uh, not really. I think things start winding down. Uh, the expo's floor is only open for half of the day. Half the day? What was going on with, like, the, uh, launcher thing outside? Oh, uh, yeah, the, um, uh, America's Got Talent is going on. <laughs> They're finally going to kill them. Door. Oh! <laughs> I guess. <laughs> Did, did they hold like a lotto? You could be like, pull! <laughs> <laughs> that's horrible. Uh, all right, that's cool. Well, hey, man, thanks for recording. What do you think is going to be the most nightmarish thing for me to try to edit and stitch together? Oh. That's not a good sound. <laughs> <laughs> that means there's a lot. <laughs> There is. Well, I already assumed that there are going to be multiple occasions of dealing with separate audio and video sources. <laughs> yeah, uh, that not so much actually. I have the microphone like directly attached to the camera. Oh, that's no fun. <laughs> yeah. Bluetooth mic. Throw it at people. Catch. <laughs> now say things. <laughs> Wake up. <laughs> All right, do we get anybody else left to torture? Uh, yeah, we got. So who we got the left? To... <laughs> yeah, see if Strider wants to come back in. I don't want to mess with my face. Oh, also we got uh, Nicole here. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Scale. Hello. <laughs> Hi. What's going on? So, what did you find interesting at scale this year? So, this is my fourth scale. Oh, shit. And I almost exclusively stay in the expo hall because I really love talking to the organizations and finding out why open source is so powerful then. Mm -hmm. And to many of them, it's because they see the human inside technology. So many people see technology and they think of it as so cold logic, but it's really about people and making li people's lives better. And that's what really drew me to tech. So open source is kind of like the Borg, it eats humans. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so well, Nicole, how long have you been with the- I don't the, get uh, hired to make analogies, way? man, come on. <laughs> Five years, I think. Five years? All right. <laughs> yeah, I believe around four or five years. All right. Okay. So, uh, 
what did you think of Jill all of a sudden going, oh, these Linux game cast guys, you should totally meet them. They're totally awesome. There's one coming for scale. So we know Jill's view on the matter. How did you and the rest of the Linux girls react? <laughs> Probably I was so excited. Yeah. I wish everyone could come every single year and we could just have this huge house party. Like it's it's been wonderful. I, I mean the whole open source community is, is so friendly. Uh last night we stayed up until like 1.30 playing role playing games and it was it was great. I love I love geeking out with other geeks. <laughs> So when you were talking okay. about the hall, what's going on there? Like, how how is scale split up? Like, is so there... there's the expo hall. Well, the Pasadena Convention Center is in two separate buildings. Okay, so it's right. already confusing. In one building, they have a few lecture halls, and then the expo. That's usually where I stay. And in the other one, they just have smaller rooms where they could have. Smaller, more intimate talk. No, I, 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 I was having a good time. I'm watching Jordan, and I was like, oh, someone told Jordan to get in the corner. I was... So, with, with like, the different talks, I mean, so Strider has his Lutris booth, and Linux Chicks, you guys, have, is that just, like, by itself? Then there's, like, okay, part B is where everyone's giving talks all day. Exactly. The the talks are separate from the expo halls. Hmm. All right. Okay. <laughs> okay. So uh, how many people this year did you have at the uh, Linux Chicks LA booth? If you have an idea. <laughs> yeah, they get a clicker, Pedro. It felt like, sometimes it felt like there were 15 <laughs> yeah, yeah. of us. All right. Okay. <laughs> a lot of people. A lot of people want to come and talk to us and... I mean, we're fun. We're fun people. <laughs> Not too scary. So, so, well, sometimes I smile at people and they give me this weird look and then they shuffle away. And I'm like, what did I do? Do not run. We are your friends. <laughs> Am I aggressively smiling? Aggressively smiling. <laughs> I think I that's realize. just when you find the normies, as some people call them, and you have a geek that's genuinely happy. It's like, oh, look, check it out. There's people that actually want to talk to me. And it's like, oh, that's genuine happiness. I'm going to run away now. Pedro, you just fear human contact. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> some people are really responsive. Like, they, they come, they want to chat forever. That's great. But I, I don't know why. That's fine. Some people, you, you and it's be... only when it's just me. It's just you. I don't know. Yeah. You think about it, though. Like, when you're out, like, just hanging out and you're walking, it's like personal experience. If I'm walking by somebody and they just look at me and smile, I'm like, oh, shit, where's this going? <laughs> it's really? like, where do you I, know me from? I, <laughs> yeah, it, this I runs through my head. I was and like, people oh. tend to smile at me, back at me. Because smiling's my default face. Default like, this face. isn't happiness. Is it also this, your war face? This isn't happiness. <laughs> this is my every face. <laughs> right on. I don't know. Uh, people could be like that. I, I have don't... resting smiley face. <laughs> <laughs> well played. Well played. <laughs> it's better than your default state being mildly irritated. Unless your default state is mildly irritated and you're just hiding it. Very successful. <laughs> Okay, I have a, I have the smiling face, and then I have like, if you don't back up, you're gonna die. Face. You don't back up. <laughs> <laughs> no in between. No in between. All right. That's the cool. you're dead to me face. Okay, I saw a Truggy showing up yeah. there. You want to pass him the uh, Truggy screwed the up. headset? We know he's up there. Okay, Truggy. Nice talking to you. Oh, he's not. Steven. Oh, we oh, got Steve. Yeah. Yeah, well, no. Oh, we got Steve. All right, cool. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness. Hello, Steve. Steve, all right. No, nobody's listening. Just between me and you, who smells the worst? I know, this is a tough one. Not because nobody smells, because I said the worst. And there's like some top three contenders this year. 
Uh, I'll just give it collectively to DevOps, okay? DevOps? DevOps. Oh, I got gotcha. you. <laughs> I mean, you might as well just point at Jordan. I mean, you're not really very cold. <laughs> oh, but uh, uh, never fear. Oh, I did uh, bring something here. We are. We're going to rectify the situation, and uh, we are bringing a banana to scale. There we go. <laughs> yes. Banana we need a banana scale. for scale. I'm glad somebody did that. Jordan was really upset that it didn't click. <laughs> so Okay, I, so uh, I don't know why no one thought of it before because well there is a there is a bunch of us. Well mm-hmm. but, uh, as uh as the one, you know, non Linux geek in the mix of all those people, how do you feel? <laughs> well, I'm the booth babe. It's great. Yeah. <laughs> yes, oh, we've the, established that. So we established that last year. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm, at a, I'm at a booth run by women, and uh, I'm standing there, and I don't know a thing. Uh, you know. Know <laughs> and people approach you. It's like, yeah. okay, so what do you do with the Linux Chicks LA? It's like, I'm here for my pretty looks. <laughs> no, yeah, actually, you know, it's, it's really fun. And sometimes it's, it's actually very useful to not know a lot. Like, um, I actually helped get some of the interviews lined up today for Jill um, because I asked the simplest, most innocent questions about their project. Using the old you know, sympathy and card. Were... And like, oh, yes. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll do your show, little buddy. <laughs> they give you a hug. Okay, so I have a, yeah, I have a resting sympathy face. Um, <laughs> so, it's going to be a thing now. It's illegal in four states. So I love to use it. <laughs> no, but it is always a treat, and uh, like Nicole said, it's uh, there's so many more stories about other than just the minutia of the code. Uh, again, the doctors trying to use the technology to do amazing things and help people. It was small projects. There's there's so much hope at this place, and that's really neat. All these people come together, and they finally are amongst like-minded people and can promote themselves amongst the people who who matter. Um, no, right. look at the yeah, I mean, not to mention uh, Justin talked about his job interviews it's amazing, he was too modest to say it, but one of the companies is flying into their headquarters oh, nice um, nice so yeah. um, on a scale of so, 1 to 10 so he better up his Patreon there you go <laughs> man you're all about money steve some of us want the human connection and we're concerned about the people not the money well i was pandering directly to you Ven. um so i can get back to my normal self i suppose um just trying to shill for you um, okay, so the, as I, I don't the, know uh, how to visually do that to the joke that JPEG Pedro, so you take the next one. Yeah. <laughs> so as the toy person, uh, were there any screen. like really nice gadgets that you saw that you really enjoyed and you want to play with at uh, scale? Uh, the one talk that I made sure that I attended um, is the JPL Open Rover program. Where they are making a replica of the uh, Curiosity of Mars 2020 rover. Yeah, we talked about that on Weekly yeah. Daily Wednesday. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, well, the, the people who are doing the, the sort of the beta build for JPL were here with two of their rovers to show off. Okay. There's a, there was a high powered one, too. Yeah, it's, mm-hmm. it's really neat to hear them talk about all the different ways they had to solve problems. They're trying to make it cheaper. I think the first robot, yeah, well, was $2,500. Uh, JPL is not even done building theirs yet, and the uh, San Gabriel Valley Linux Users Group, I think I got that right, um, or an offshoot thereof, uh, had theirs together and working, and were able to help nice. influence JPL's design. Um, and and <clears throat> yes, as, 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 a, as a toy guy, I ended up talking and asking them some questions afterwards and had a nice conversation. Um, and it's a really fun project, because once they get the robots built, they actually change, they can change the wheel hubs um, you know, with the name of a school and take it for over there for education purposes and then amongst other things. Yeah, so it's really, there's stuff around that's uh, everywhere. And I think there's another uh, JPL or NASA talk this weekend as well. So something for okay. my husband. Did you mm-hmm. wacky lot have a good time at SpaceX or was it just like, hey, let's go stand in front of the uh, Falcon rocket and take an upside down picture? <laughs> it's, 
It's one of those things where in, in real life, yeah, it, it seems like that's all it would be. And to a certain extent, yeah, we could have been standing in front of a water tower. But it is different when you see it in real life because you realize that little pencils thing you see landing backwards on the barge is big, mm -hmm. it's impressive. And that's, that singular piece of hardware is the actual uh, first ever successfully landed orbital class booster. So that's a huge piece of history. It's and smoke and mirrors, man. NASA told house. me it couldn't be done. <laughs> hashtag, <laughs> hashtag flat Mars. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, that's the ultimate though, twist. I... It's not the Earth. It's Mars that's flat. I know. We got to get off this topic and we got we got to chase Steve off because we're talking about space yeah. and we only, we only yeah. got like 10 more yeah. minutes. Okay. I just wanted to say it's kind of cool seeing what the other, uh, what my living room looks like from the other side. Oh, neat. Okay. Oh, hi, Steve. Jill on the couch later. Okay. Bye. It looks exactly like the damn show, Steve. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah, fun. we could totally have Steve on for the whole show. <laughs> oh, abso absolutely! You wanna you wanna geek out with the guy? He's the, he's the guy to do it with. All right, is that going to be a continuation or the end of our? Yeah, uh, Str Strider said he's good. Uh, no one else wanted to come up. Brilliant. Uh, so fine. We didn't want to talk to him anyway. Okay. <laughs> I mean, listen. I so listen, I've, been, I've been talking to a guy nonstop. I'm saying his voice. I I, 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 <laughs> I want I want you to whisper sweet nothings into my ear. Not gonna lie, I. I was enjoy watching you fidget in the corner. <laughs> yeah. So uh, we actually forgot to ask Empty what exactly happened with the VLC brigade. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> apparently, appara <laughs> so so that so you know the the, the VLC uh, logo is like the traffic cone, right? So they had mm -hmm. a bunch of like plush traffic cone hats, and they're wearing <laughs> them. And apparently, Empty called one of them the safety wizard, and uh, <laughs> they were they were they were not too pleased about that. <laughs> do you think somebody's going to bed tonight and they're like i'm not a safety wizard i want to be the safety wizard what the hell are you talking or do you about? think like behind closed doors is like call me the safety wizard i am the safety <laughs> wizard right. yeah that, 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 that's where my brain went yeah, yeah. all right, all right that concludes our scale 17 coverage yep and scale stravaganza coming up next we got, we got a little bit of hate mail from Oren about Sandy. Hmm. And you. Mostly Sandy. <laughs> Boop. Boop. Got like 30 minutes out of that somehow. All right. We did it. We did it, Twitch Soup. We did it. <laughs> um. Oh, man, it was starting to get warm in here with all those people. Well, as I told the live stream, I just wanted to see what the load capacity was on that upper floor. Uh, <laughs> it could have got interesting. Oh, yeah. As I say, legitimately knowing at any fucking time this dust can go. Yep. <laughs> I mean, and it will just be... <laughs> you just see the monitor slightly topple over towards Vez like, oh, shit. <laughs> yeah. Just, it's the first noise. night I put it up. I slept with that one ear like or if I catch it right when it cracks I might be able to get in there and save the monitor <laughs> no by the time you hear it it's too late probably by the time you hear it, it's already hit the table the sound just hasn't made it to the bedroom <laughs> well things are it's not like the 28 inch monitor's fucking light either <laughs> Yeah. yeah. Then I have these two He's monitors gonna... on this corner. I mean, this thing structurally it's loaded. It's like 115 mm -hmm. pounds of monitors on this desk. Easy. But I did get to thinking about pounds, it. That's like 50 kilos. <laughs> it's a bit, isn't it? 
Yeah, that's a bit. <laughs> Here's what I was thinking about, which I guess maybe in a way we should know is CRT monitors and glass desks, they weren't a thing. Hmm. They were a thing in certain showrooms. I remember seeing that. Maybe a show stationary, something that never got touched, plate glass, mm -hmm. carefully put. I could see. Because plate they glass were always can a lot of weight. Close to the corners. Hmm. <laughs> McGoover? Please tell me that's not how you really spell MacGyver. MacGyver? <laughs> it's MacGyver with an I. <laughs> with an extra U. Ah, <laughs> uh, come on, man. Revisionist <sighs> history. Seems about right. Or so, <laughs> so the party tells me to believe. So, I don't know. Was the uh, recent TV series of MacGyver any good? I didn't it's still it. on. I, d I didn't watch it. Oh, it's still no, going. No Richard okay. Anderson. I don't care. I've never I, seen I mean, it. What? I'm not going to watch it. Um, <laughs> I thought it was like a one season the, thing. <laughs> no. So like the, the, the remake of Hawaii Five-0 has gone on for nine seasons now. It's what? ridiculous. Yeah. I didn't know that's been around that, that I, long. I thought it was like yeah, maybe that I two knew years, about. three years. Huh. Because Fox in Portugal just basically ran the episodes back to back certain days. <laughs> I know NCIS is still on question mark. Oh yeah, Nick Nickus. That's on <laughs> and... What oh is Grey's Anatomy still on? Uh no, I think that one actually ended. Did it? <laughs> Um, uh, I, you know, I don't know jack shit about Grey's Anatomy, so. Anatomy? Anatomy? Yeah, that's, 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 that's what I think Anatomy. that show's called, because I know so little about it. What the? Um. What is floating around on your monitor? Oh, no, it's still, it's still going. Never mind. Are you seeing that? Season 15. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You got, you got a little fun, oh, I... Jordan. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's the reflection of the LED of the cable being plugged into the uh, the headset. No, it's <laughs> not. Listen. This guy? Hey, listen. Yeah, it is. Because hey! when Jordan listen. covers it. <laughs> this is no, the, 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 no, I'm 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 charging these headphones while I'm using it. This is just the LED on the uh, Bring back Navi. Headphones. There we go. See? Listen. Hey, yeah. This is pain. This is pain. This is pain. <laughs> <laughs> it took me a minute. It's like it's like, reflecting actually, actually, off we, the... we should... something <laughs> off my face. Yeah, beard reflection. I can't tell. It, it, it once upon a time was plugged into my head. No, it's... no. nah, <laughs> can't do it. Can't be. Can't be replicated. It's impossible. Okay, we just 16. Wow. <laughs> Jesus. Wow. Yeah, the, the 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 lady who plays like the spunky golf girl is like 50. Yeah, she was 40 mm -hmm. when it started, yeah. Yeah. Huh. All right. Well, let's do the hate mail. Bail out of here. Yeah. Yes. I see, I, know, I, see, I see the blue dot on my face. It's like I guess right here. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it's. it's well, I couldn't the... tell because this thing's not matte. It's glossy. Ah. So I yeah, thought yeah, maybe yeah. it was like is like. Mm. Then I looked over here. This is why I asked Pedro, "Are you seeing those? Am I, are you seeing this, or am I having a stroke? Yes. <laughs> All right, about Dark Souls, it's like I could, <laughs> but I don't know no. The thing if about you... Dark Souls, every time I play it, it makes my butt itch. 
If you, uh, well, if playing Dark Souls gives you a butt itch, feel free to head on over to LinuxGameCast.com. You hit the contact button, you fill out the form, you let us know how exactly your butt itches. Is it on one of the cheeks? Is it in the crack? Is it right near your butthole? You need to uh, give us all the details because, well, Lord knows we kind of need something for this particular segment because y'all don't uh, send a lot of hate mail our way for some reason. Oh, we so... get it, baby. It's just, <laughs> we don't do the low effort <laughs> shit. Yeah. yeah. No, you, you, we, we, we only take that prime grade A trolling that is just so rare these days. <laughs> I mean, we, we do the good stuff, and every now and then we do one. Yeah, there's or yes, this like, week. Like, 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 like this week. He, 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 he writes... End me. End me, end me, please. Won't you end me? Kill me. Oh, please. Won't you kill me? Jordan, why do people who have absolutely no idea how software works think they have a better understanding of the software than the people who do? I don't know, actually made the software? Why are there so many armchair experts in the FOSS community who are BTW hypocrites to the bone? The typical, I'm very security oriented and I prioritize privacy, but I prefer to use Windows in my personal life. Notice, douchey McNozzle didn't mention anything about work. Also, why do I seem to attract these kinds of people? Also, Sandy, if you're seeing this, please adopt me, uwu. Love, Orn. Well, and, and if you want to take this? Where, where's Orn currently at? I think he's still in Stockholm. He's in Sweden. So... Yeah. Swedish are basically uh, pink Eskimos, right? Yeah, they're, 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 uh, they're offshoot Germans. They're, they're kind of weird. <laughs> hi sweden please let me in your country i want to live there one day <laughs> yeah if that doesn't get you blacklisted i want to move there too uh, uh, <laughs> i don't know man so what do you think Gordon's trying to say he's having a problem with windows people or he's just having a problem with like privacy focused I people I, I think it's a little bit of both. Now, to be to be fair, um, the the people who actually the people who actually do security under Windows do know what the fuck they're talking about because they are daily drivering one of the most backdoored holy OSs on the face of the planet. Mm. So they better know what they're doing to get their paycheck. Um, that's that said, yeah, a lot of a lot of privacy folks don't uh, don't end up using Linux, which I find quite odd. Uh, I don't I don't necessarily think it's hypocritical. I think it's just lack of education. Um, uh, or just I, laziness because they buy a laptop, it comes preloaded in Windows, like, eh, whatever. But there's also like the levels and, of privacy, even when you're talking about like laptops, you know, you do have people that are full metal stallmen. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, they, they, they only use open platforms. Um, yeah, like e e even so, do, do, you, do you do full encryption on your laptop, full disk encryption on your laptops? Sweet yeah. the fuck all no. I I do. <laughs> see, see, like there, there's all sorts of paranoid shit you can do to harden your box, but a lot of it is just inconvenient. And a lot of a lot of people who are security minded are okay taking the risk because they know that other more risky behavior will get them in trouble a lot faster than leaving their disk unencrypted. Yeah, I, I'm kind of like a fatalist, though. It's like I assume any alphabet agency that wants my shit has got it. Oh yeah. Well, you remember those slides? SSL, those NSA slides. SSL <laughs> added and removed here. Oh boy, they can just do that, can't they? Yeah, right. they can. Yep. <laughs> Once you get the grass, with their bending fiber optics. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Come on. I think we're good. Mm -hmm. uh, as as for Sandy adopting you, dude has three kids already. You think I think I think he's going for five because yeah. he wants to be able to say I got five kids to feed because he's a really big fan. Total Recall. But <laughs> he wants to grow a sentient chest tumor. I mean, he already did. Ah, damn! That boy's he's, always he's, ahead he's, of the curve. He's wor he's working on that third booby now. One day, one day. <laughs> mm, sexy Sandy. <laughs> Very beautiful people. Thanks for sticking with us. We made it through. Uh, send us some uh, thoughts, hints, allegations, and all that other crazy stuff. But you can't do it right now. You have to do it next week when uh, yes. we get to that. Because indeed. Maybe that's the wrong damn song. <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> there we go. That bumps up. You've set through another fine, glorious, delightful Acer commercial. And I want to thank you for that. Um, 
Brought to you by Acer. Brought to you by <laughs> Sunday's monitors. Uh, if you want to get a hold of me, I'm at Vince Stone. I'm just at, I think I'm at Vince Stone on Mastodon. Mastodon.linkscamecast.com. I'm on Twitter and all that fun stuff. I'll get back to you. It's easy. It's just at Reply Me in our Discord. I'm always in there. Or I'm around. I read things occasionally. Yeah, I'm Jordan Swung. I'm in Pasadena for another day or so. So if you want to come by scale, give me a hug. I will break your ribs. You can follow me otherwise at The Burning Fool on Twitter, plus Jordan Swung on Google Plus until they kill that in a couple weeks. And on our Mastodon at Frojo at mastodonmixgamecast.com. And I am Pedro Mateos. You probably won't see me going out too often because I'm... Well, I like playing computer games, but hey, if you want to, you know, shoot the shit and uh, argue with me on Twitter, you can find me. That's at unaccounted4. There's the link right there. That's just the thing you need to look for. It's, yeah, I'm totally down for some arguments on over the internet. <laughs> mm-hmm. Or, <laughs> I, 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 I mean, I, n- next year we're getting a cardboard standee of Pedro just so we can carry him around and take photos with him. I <laughs> can make that happen, actually. I... Very good friends with somebody who has the technology to print those things whenever you need them. Make it so, number one. Fuck. Okay, okay. I'll get a full body picture then. How about we roll some full body credits? <laughs> oh, right. yeah. Some, some some rich, earthy, full bodied credits. Mmm. Taste of dirt. Tastes good. Whoa, whoa. Oh, I heard I, it was I an heard absolutely scale horrific condition. Uh, let's yeah. thank our executive producers, our theorist, Mr. Fox Dog, and Atomic Mike G. Bar, Brian, Trump, Savin, Aldius, Aplo, Mackie. We even talked to some of them. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> Mackie, Mackie, shut up. Empty was here. Um, yeah. <laughs> so, Tur- why Turkey, is... around somewhere. Yep. Mirror, what are the random pictures from? I don't... I don't know. I can go downstairs and ask him because he's here. Um, I don't I know. Think, I think... Uh, you know what? I, I, I've, I've thought better of it. Never mind. Good. Good, <laughs> good man. Good man. <laughs> we see you have not smoked yourself. Retarded. Yep. Nope. Oh, oh I, I, I have, but I'm an idiot savant. Not from lack of trying. <laughs> it is Thank California, you, after all. <laughs> Actually, didn't uh, the didn't the UK just legalize cannabis for medical use? It's like on a Tuesday it's after four. Going PM. up for approval. Yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. Start, medical start smoking use. Weed, Pedro. <laughs> Listen, you need all I'm the help bo- you can get. Dynafire. My body we doesn't love you. like the... Yeah. <laughs> this is, oh, yeah. has like the same basic backbeat as the Weezer. Mary Tyler Moore. And, uh, dun, dun, dun. He looks just like Buddy. Yeah, yeah, it, yeah. yeah it's, the, it's the same meter. Yeah. yeah. Well, now the, I can't unhear that. I listen, man. That was the one use I ever had for a Windows ninety five CD because it had the Weezer video on it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it shipped with it to show off this thing called music. Well, video, basically. Ah, we survived. Indeed. I'm, I'm not sure if I go downstairs, I'm going to keep surviving, but we'll see. Mm-hmm. There we go. Got to lock myself in Strider's room. Hopefully he doesn't come and lick me again without putting some salt <laughs> on me first. See, that's a man. You just honestly want to get licked again. I mean, I licked him back and he's kind of greasy and stubbly. That's what that's my takeaway. <laughs> True story. So, if you needed hot sauce, what would you say he needed to be tasty? Class. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know. Literally anything. A comb. Some more booze. Uh, 
Oh. Man, I got a lot of redecking to do. So, what are the plans, man? What plans? I don't know. You think plan for the after shows? And half the crew's there, so. <laughs> Right, yeah, like I'm, 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 I'm not, I'm not sure. Um... We thought this through. We're professionals. Don't worry. I know, right? Yeah, it's fucking blew a thousand bucks. Flew out here. I know exactly what I'm doing. <laughs> I don't know. I just think maybe we'll. How many people are at home? Um. So I know. So, uh, what, how many people are here? Uh, Steve, Jill, Nicole, Truggy, Empty, Strider, Alan, Tyson, and I think that's it. I oh. know. We could do. Um... <laughs> yes, clearly. Gang we've been playing so much we've been playing so much gang beasts you guys how about we do like a round of bracketeering that way anybody could sure. join in through their mobile device or anything like that yeah okay sure and I think our stream delays short enough to where everyone can play if they want or if they don't that's cool I'm not your boss mm-hmm I don't know, there are, there are enough people with laptops here. Let me see. I know my neck legitimately does hurt. <laughs> <laughs> I can't see anything. It's weird, man. I'll be glad I can't stick. see. It fucks with you. I don't like not being able to see the other side of things. Ah. I don't like that. I don't like having my back to shit, and I don't like not being able to... Plus, the other side's white, which pisses me off. Mm. Yeah. White, whiteness pisses you off. Mm -hmm. No, that's why you're so... That's why you're, why you're so angry at us. The price is baby hands. Well... That <laughs> Why does he gotta pay? That, that <laughs> wouldn't be very effective. Um... Yeah. What the fuck's a light? Oh. Hmm. All right. Fair enough. <laughs> I just had to. We're, le that. we're learning things. Play along with them. Which one's bracketeering? I in? see some Vesa holes in the back. I just realized that. Do it. Yeah. <laughs> One hundred by fuck you two hundred. <laughs> oh, are they are they doing a going out of business random picture posting person? Oh, no, they're doing uh, they're doing game net at scale. So someone actually set one up. Play some Gorn. Or some keep talking. Nobody explodes. How about spank the You want to get pink eye? Because that's how you get pink eye. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you, know, you know how else you get pink eye? You know how else you get pink eye. Earbuds. <laughs> that's pink ear. That's, yeah. <laughs> pink ear in the brain. Inside of the brain. <laughs> Yeah, we had some side press. Be quiet, nineteen ninety. <laughs> yeah, all right. This is the one with bracketeering. Yeah, I think. Thump 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 Mm-hmm. 
Ah, oh, okay. Hmm. Yeah, no, that's just the heartbeat. <laughs> That is the sound of my heart about to explode from all that red meat. How many steaks did you have? I just had the one. Oh. Well, who's... Oh, so I guess Truggy just won then. The first? <laughs> oh, no, the... What do you call it? Uh, empty steak is downstairs, too, waiting for me to eat it. Mmm, <laughs> cold steak. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's going to be very chewy. <laughs> I have functioning feet. Microwave, baby. <laughs> yeah. Ew. My, microwave steak doesn't, never turns out right. If you put enough ketchup on it. I don't have enough English. I don't have enough mayonnaise for it, though. Oh, dude. Homeboy died from an uh, airwolf. I had, I had to pour out some mayo for Yeah. Mm -hmm. Jan, Jan Michael Vincent. Yeah. It's going to fuck up Rick and Morty. No, oh, they, can't, they can't do Jan Michael Vincent. They can't do Jan Quadrant Vincent anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Someone's coming up the stairs. I wonder who it is. No, oh, no. Ha! I'm in. Sweet. Zubbins. 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 Fro. What's up, Fro? Venu. Fro. <laughs> fro. I don't. I don't know. Ven. 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 Oh, Venu. Fro. You can't emphasize the end too hard. <laughs> There's lick. <laughs> LRT. Cat. <laughs> oh. Come on, everyone watching the stream. Oh. <laughs> It lowers my chances of winning. <laughs> From almost zero to exactly zero. Dude, I don't want to hit negative. <laughs> oh, some of the Linux chicks are playing some uh, air hockey. The... No, man. That's the devil's plinko. <laughs> ah, LRT is Miss Ruler. It's the devil's pachinko. Hello, Satan's Mikey. shuffleboard. <laughs> Again. <laughs> what? Again. Uh, there's, I keep I keep wanting to fuck around with this thing, but it makes too much. It's fun. a fucking piggy bank, you motherfucker. I know, and I'm desperately trying to not take all the money inside because this isn't my money. <laughs> I'm trying not to thieve. <laughs> I know it's difficult for it's a Canadian. Really hard. It's really hard not to burgle these people. Truggy, come on. I put a link in there. Jackbox.tv, enter the room code ZVNS. Zvins. 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 Heaven. I already get something to drink, then we're, then we're gonna fucking hit the go button on it. Okay. Alright. Ven's gonna go get drinks, so, uh. Take out your phones, open up a browser, and join us for some bracketeering. <laughs> All right, Truggy, I'll type it to you just because I'm such a nice guy. <laughs> also, you drive me around places, so. <laughs> and he's downstairs and he could just run up there and, uh, I don't know, drop kick you in the head. <laughs> he doesn't have enough mass to successfully drop kick me. <laughs> That's the thing, it's all concentrated. <laughs> 
He needs to concentrate more. Man, working off a single 1080p monitor sucks. I miss my dual 4Ks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't mind so much uh, the 3200 by 1800 screen on the XPS if it was a bit bigger, but it's 13.3 inches. You gotta increase like the uh, font size a little bit. It's like oh, now there's not a, not so much room on screen anymore, huh? <laughs> on screen. What about off screen? can actually shout because there's neighbors upstairs so yeah <laughs> I remember when like I got a 1080p I was like oh this is so much space now mm -hmm. amateur hour <laughs> I remember having two 1080p monitors and thinking, yeah, no, this is good. I can play a game on one and have, uh, like, Netflix or YouTube playing on the other. And now I have three and I'm like, oh, I have a game on one. I have Netflix or YouTube on the other and I have Discord and whatever else. On the third one, it's like, eh, I could use another one. <laughs> see, see what, 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 what's nice about the big UHDs and QLEG, this is... Your application space. This is your application space. This is your application space. This is... I play yeah. most of my games in a 1080p window now, just because it's like I can do other stuff. I have so much screen real estate. Yeah, but my uh, UHD monitor is only 24 inches, so all the pixel density, all the games look super crisp. It's so nice. <laughs> yeah, mine look all right, but my 1080p little windows now are like 20 inches each. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, you do have that big Acer. <laughs> Brought to you by Panasonic. I Send me a check, yeah. Acer. <laughs> yeah, it's either Panasonic, ViewSonic, or um, Samsung. <laughs> okay, I'm going to light up Discord, so... Let's find out what happens after shows in boop. A bloogie woogie woo. Blah, that's pretty good. <laughs> someone, so, apparently, someone so, according, according to this Twitter. Someone said that Robo Shop, Robocop should be a Transformer called Stoptimus Crime. <laughs> I'm down with this. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> mm. Oh, all right, we're, good. we're good to go. Shit, I accidentally fucking closed the, close the window. The window. <laughs> I did the yeah, same fucking made... thing. Fuck! Oh, where to go? All right. Come back. Hi, Dad. Hello, Joe. Why? It's been forever since we've talked. Yes. <laughs> like a couple of minutes ago. Yes. Like a couple of minutes ago, yes. Your answers will be paired off in a no-holds-barred tournament. And your votes okay. will determine which answers in advance in the bracket. On. As we whittle down to our championship winner, this is Bracketeering. Good luck, everyone. I'm sending the topic of our first bracket to your devices now. Best vacation destination for people who don't care about their personal safety. Yeah, nothing more relaxing than the threat of death. Type in the best, most winningest answer you can think of and hit send. If your answer wins the entire bracket, you'll be rolling in cash. Oh, crap. How do I spell By the way, you can join the audience and play along by going to jackbox.tv and entering the room. Bring the jack. Be the jack. Stop the miscrowing. Become the jack. Time's running out. We don't care. Okay, let's see how many actually work the same thing. Your answers are being paired off into one on one matchups. Write anything. That means it's time to introduce ourselves to the prediction table. On your device, you'll see one of the upcoming matchups for this bracket. 
If you can predict the answer that will get the most votes, you could win some sizable bonus bucks. Oh, this is gonna be <laughs> <laughs> Got that figured out. <laughs> oh, we, we got we got the true true. <laughs> Sometimes small true true. The true true, yeah. True. <laughs> the true true. Oh yes, we do, don't we? <laughs> we have the true true. <laughs> That's time at the prediction table. Let's dive into our first bracket. Oh boy. Too easy. Oh, which you think deserves to win. <laughs> but don't forget, if you change your mind, you can change your oh, vote. Let's do that. Oh. What the hell's scowl 17? Scowl. Scale what? 17x. No, it's it's someone fat it, fingered the WAD. Of course, of course, this is going to win. Of course it is. Everyone's in on the duck. Of course it is. A cash prize if you predicted this would happen. Mine was legit. <laughs> Listen, three of those are the same <laughs> thing. <laughs> bedroom. <laughs> no brainer. I fear for my life right now. <laughs> this one's looking over. Oh, Perfect one. If it was Strider's yeah. bedroom in Ben's house. <laughs> well, maybe he can have a bedroom in my house, mister. I have a bedroom in this house. <laughs> True story. Free the lead's nation and drifters. <laughs> <struggle is> <laughs> Cleveland. Okay. <laughs> TIL. Cleveland. <laughs> Apparently, Cleveland's oh, really bad. <laughs> oh, yeah, here we go. Another variation on it, but I'm going to go with that one. Yeah. What, what, what I want to see is what's more dangerous, Strider's bedroom or just his entire place normally? What about Strider's place on the moon? Come on, Chicago kicks ass, come on. Yeah, that's, that's why you shouldn't go there, or you should go there, because Chicago kicks ass. No, I'm not going to Strider's ass. <laughs> you'll do it and you'll like it then. It's too pretentious. Up waiting for you on your device. Oh, for fuck's sake, this one's gonna be tricky. I wonder who will win Strider's uh, room or Strider's house. Moon house. <laughs> the, the, the room and the moon in the house. <laughs> I'm LRC. Come on, John, you can do it. <laughs> Come on, Lindrew. <laughs> Lindrew. <laughs> it's better than the true true. Time's up at the <laughs> prediction table. Let's jump back to our bracket for Dude, round two. Wall just then. Is that Jill? These answers exchanged some harsh well, words at the press conference. Did you just play? No. Heard oh, someone. Oh, did someone say a naughty word? <laughs> someone with a female voice did. And? Come on, Australia. No, no, no. Come on, Australia. Come on. Confirm Strider's bedroom more dangerous than Australia. Salmonella. Yep. The finals are just a win away from these next two answers. This one's just. Yeah. I'm gonna do this one. Come on, Cleveland. It's the showdown. It's the showdown that we all want to see. <laughs> yep. On, the place or the bedroom. <laughs> oh God damn it! I clicked it too many times. It's going to stop. No, you're not doing anything. <laughs> the battle of Strider versus Strider. Uh, and now the final. Is, is, is that the less popular sequel to Kramer versus Kramer? Is that your final Strider? We need to play. Who wants to be a dollar nair? Who wants to? Who wants to be a Strider? <laughs> Who wants to be a Strider there? Oh shit. Oh, okay. Just the bedroom. <laughs> I guess the bedroom is winning. <laughs> oh, 
Oh shit. Oh, 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 Shook out. Chill. Come on. <laughs> Dominated. I did poorly. I got points. <laughs> <laughs> it's time for the blind bracket. Oh no. Visually impaired, thank you very much. Mm -hmm. the first name you'd like to have. Go ahead and write the first thing that comes to mind. We'll see the real bracket title after you answer. God damn it, who took mine? <laughs> Jordan, you typed it quicker than I did. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> yep, I got it. I'm in frame. <laughs> Damn it. Let's see what this bracket is really about. Best name for the most popular kid in school. Oh shit. My real name is no. Dandelion. I was not popular. Time to get in those predictions. <laughs> yep. <laughs> you... Yep. All right. Someone's flying to the crowd. <laughs> That's the only way you win at this game. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, true. <laughs> well, you see, Truggy Come logged on, true, in true. twice, but he won't be nice enough to log out of one of them. That's time on the prediction table. Up first. <laughs> I'm voting for Madison. Because somebody beat me to type in Turbo Cock Smash. I don't know fucking who, but they did. <laughs> Team Madison. Preheat the oven to 425. We have a winner. Preheat the oven to 420, motherfuckers. Blaze of time. Moving on to our next matchup. Scorpion. 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 Challenger Scorpion. appears. Get over here. Scorpion. <laughs> Get close to me. Because it's, it's not Scorpion, it's Scorpion. Scorpion. Get close to me so I can give you a big smoochie. <laughs> Sorry, Jason. Obviously. Obviously. What kind of asshole names are Kid Jordan? <laughs> it was a joint effort. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, no contest on this one. Uh, it's, it's gonna be Turbo Cock Smasher versus Brad. I'm calling it now. Clash of Titans. <laughs> and now our last two contenders face off. Okay. I actually know someone named Baron. Then I'm gonna go for Lewis. <laughs> One answer is showing some promise. Oh god, Lewis. I'm surprised no one suggested Henry Bob. <laughs> I don't know, man. We we needed uh, like Jordan Von Coxmash. Get out of the way. <laughs> I'm changing my name, by the way, <laughs> to that. We have a few lucky winners. Yeah, no, my family was smashing chickens He's back in the old country. It's time to make another prediction. Getting the chickens. Mm. Yeah, we all know which one's gonna win this one with the landslide. TikTok. TikTok. Of course, because we're all wholly unoriginal. TikTok, motherfucker. Aha, the ticking clock. Time's running out. 
Be quiet, 1980s rap. <laughs> Time to step away from the prediction table. Let's jump back to our bracket for round two. I don't know why I threw the 19 in there. It's like, no, you mean 1880s? Um, <laughs> yes. <laughs> You can do a scorp again. Scorpion. Scorpion. Sorry, Trugs. <laughs> One more match to determine our finals. <laughs> Duh. Oh so it was foretold. Destroyed. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Lewis. <laughs> it's always Christmas somewhere. It's all Brad all the time. Not, not yeah. Brad, yeah. Brad Day to challenge him. Brad Max. H Brad and TV. Now the definitive matchup. What is the best Brad's name for the most popular kid? No. <laughs> Can why not both? <laughs> Brad's Herbo Cock Smasher. <laughs> well, it sounds better, I mean, than fuck <laughs> roosters, right? Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, god damn it, Brad. <laughs> damn it, Brad. <laughs> Brad doesn't take kindly. Yeah, you did, Brad. You won. <laughs> Yeah, I'm dropping. <laughs> I am. <laughs> Time for the finale. The triple blind oh bracket. This bracket will change every single round. Here's your oh starting boy. category. Write any two words and place and or ampersand between them. Who knows what crazy twists and turns this bracket will take. Not exactly family friendly, but close enough. <laughs> Time's running out. Let's see, who's going to be the most PC about this? I don't know, it depends on who gets <laughs> no from orbit. Let's see what we're dealing with. <laughs> Judas title for a Saturday morning cartoon oh, show. Yes! Oh, no. No. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh shit. session with fruit for a second now? <laughs> hey, don't kink shame. <laughs> oh, well, it's quite a big time fruit. Is up. Starting things off. Only one can come out on top. Well, I mean, Dungeons and Dragons was a Saturday morning cartoon, right. so... Yeah. <laughs> I think that's the reason I don't like Dungeons and Dragons. That was a shit cartoon. Yeah, it wasn't great. <laughs> yeah, it was bad. Yeah, somehow I knew that was gonna win. Oh, that was a Our next matchup... <laughs> Lewis and Brad. Beer. That's my favorite Saturday morning cartoon. <laughs> Bar Wars, chips and pine. Yeah, let's go chips and pine. It's the adventures of beer and weed. <laughs> one's really irate and violent, the other one doesn't want to do anything. The other couple, in other words. Aww. <laughs> Fun. What do we see? What's going on on the other side no. of the bracket? No, bad idea. This <laughs> is a big one. <laughs> Pretty fucking weak. Mm. Yeah, th yeah, this is a weak one. <laughs> yeah. An upset in the making. 
go beef and bean because it makes me tired. Why not? All right, how do you motherfuckers get beef and bean tangled with Smash and Dash? What the hell's wrong with you? Come on. I know, yeah. So, some, someone's, several of you are brain damaged. <laughs> Mr. Alert one. All right, beef and bean. He's paying people off, man. It's time to round out the bracket with this vicious matchup. Obviously. I didn't shoot his. <laughs> no one did snake oh and bacon. God. I'm, I'm not. I got the sets. <laughs> Just running out the clock now. Soup. We're changing that bracket title again. Best name for a truck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, beef and bean would have been good for that. <laughs> <laughs> this is yeah. too real, too yeah. real, man. Um. <laughs> Morag, which one's so not all, a truck all stop? All that's left is the true true. Right. <laughs> Time's up at the prediction table. Let's jump back to our bracket for round two. <laughs> Fill her up at the old cantaloupe and <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I know I want to kill it. It's always a good choice. I know, right? Uh huh. Come on. CNA has the best sticks. Oh, oh, this one, this one's tough. Damn. Yeah. Oh, gotta be the most, what kind of gross do you want? It could be the pull and bean. <laughs> or, or the tug and beef. <laughs> pull my bean. It doesn't get any closer pull than that. Pull and tug. You get a pull and tug, you get pork and beans. Could be a pull and tug. Beer and beef, whatever. And it all comes down to this. Best euphemism for dying. <laughs> 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 oh, good times. <laughs> <laughs> well, what happened to him? Ah, oh, you know, the old cantaloupe and adel. <laughs> it's not a euphemism. He died. <laughs> that was, that was just how he died. Shoved up his ass. He suffocated. You know someone actually died from that. <laughs> ah, damn. That's a bullshit mark. Yeah. I, I, I put down cantaloupe and anal. I was hope I, I was convinced that would make it to the end. Let's see who won it all. I did too. It really bottomed out. <laughs> uh, oh, who? Pen. Whoever Pen is. <laughs> Pennywise, uh, I guess. <laughs> yeah. It's me. It's a me. Right. It's a me, penis. <laughs> it's a penis, wise. <laughs> hey, we did a thing, everyone. Yes. Right. <laughs> no lives were lost. Well, at least none that we know of. Better luck yeah. next time. Hopefully, somebody got some ideas, you know, cantaloupe, you know? <laughs> Someone got some ideas. Be careful, I don't want anyone to suffocate. <laughs> don't worry, you just give him one of the old beef and bean and they'll be fine. I'm seriously probably going to make a t-shirt that just says cantaloupe. I'm not going to sell it, I'm going to buy, make it for me. It just says cantaloupe and needle. <laughs> just wear it into work one day. I'm just going to rock that shit and just wear it out. Because I know no one's going to fucking ask me about it. <laughs> so what's the deal with... No, you know what? Never mind. <laughs> this is how I choose clothing sometimes. Because I... 
statistical improbabilities, man. Like, no one's going to come fuck with me. But they're thinking about it. They're like, what the fuck? Really? Somebody should say something. I want to go ask, but at the same time, I don't want to go ask. They don't want to ask. They want to come talk some shit. Deservedly so. Yeah. I'm like, no, you're not. You're not going to say anything. (laughs) He walked out of the house looking like that. (laughs) <laughs> he I was aware of that. I checked it out in the mirror. And it was like, really, you're wearing yeah. that? And I'm like, yeah, we're wearing this. I, I I made a conscious decision to wear this. Jordan's got it easy, man. Jordan's like, t-shirt, blue jeans. <laughs> That's my go-to. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, I yeah, just I just dress like a hooligan. That's that's my jam. Yeah. Low, it's low effort. Well, it gets the yeah. job done, man. I mean, <laughs> if the goal for leaving is to be clothed. Yes. Yeah. Get the most comfortable shit, and that's about it. Yeah. I'd, I'd probably go with, like, my truck pants. Like, my jogging pants. <laughs> I got my Adidas pants on. All right, let's do a couple of rounds of Rocket League and bounce out of here. It's getting late. Okay, you all do Rocket League. I'm actually going to sleep because I... I could have yeah. saved time and said this is the part where Pedro bills. Yes. Bye, everyone. I think I still have my controller up here. Night, Y'all Pedro. be good. Uh, night, Pedro. Night, Pedro. He's already left. It's too late for him. Jordan has to get... Why does Jordan's room say Isabel in it? <laughs> you Cause see, cause you know how I know you haven't been around very long. Family. <laughs> That's a thing. Doesn't one of the rooms have a castle in it? Yes, it does. It sure does. In fact, that's the one that Jordan sleeps in, and then Mackie was in the castle. <laughs> so cute. It's cute in a horrifying kind of way, but yeah. most yeah. things are really when you break it down, boil it down. In the Ooh, night. someone just spilled some beer. Oh, oh Mackie. Yeah, I'd be afraid some doll would kill me in my sleep in the Isabel room. I know, I was just yeah. thinking that. I would pay extra. <laughs> uh, Rocket League? Yeah, no, this is, it's, it's, yeah. Obviously, they had kids, so they have several rooms with the... Oh, <laughs> I'm in-game Rocket League, so I'd have no idea what we'll be playing next. I'm trying to get Rocket League running, but... Nope, you're not allowed. Too late. All right, I have to resize. That and that, there we go. Let's try this one more time, shall we? One more time. All right, Jordan's getting his controller. Who wants to play? We're going to be short and sweet with this. I'll play. If you guys have space, that'd be super. I can shut down paper with pop. Let's look at this new friends list. Oh, 
Thank you, Mr. Fenn. Mm -hmm. Oh, we got two of the same cars. Two very unique. Pennywise in uh what do we have in? Yeah I might have to skip the first one because I'm restarting the stream. It's taking the fucking ever to do this. So I think I might be out for this one. Jordan's not making a happy face. Okay, let's see who can be quieter. No? Maybe? Okay, there we go. What'd That's you do? Problems. No, I, I'm, I unplugged the... Uh, I only got two uh, USB like two, uh, 3.0 ports on this laptop. The other ones are Type-C. I had to unplug... Um, this guy to plug in the controller and the audio just cut out. Ah, seems to Yeah, so, yeah, try, trying to figure out why is this happening? Because because you get that weird thing where PMU control is like showing the VU meter moving, but I'm not hearing anything. Mm. So now it's go through all the tabs, what's wrong, repair the thing. Yeah. Whole deal, the whole ordeal. All right, Rocket League. I guess I can close all these browser windows now. Nah, man. Um, actually, let's do this. Uh, oh, Firefox. Something's eating all my CPU. Life gets interesting when you're down to one monitor. It does. Um, the fuck am I doing? Rocket League. Yes. Thank you. Yeah, I put Rocket League on here. That was like one of the first games I installed. All right. I think I've launched. I've, I think I've actually only launched Rocket League on this machine like once. Okay, is that a threat? I'm, yes. Good. I respond well to those. Excellent. Also a promise. Yes. Loading. I do. What does it have? Like the fifty four hundred RPM NVMe in it? Oh no! This, uh, no, Sh uh, first time shader compiling, I guess. Yeah. Uh. 
This one, this one actually doesn't have an NVMe in it. Interesting. Yeah, just uh, just plain old side SSD. I didn't feel like paying for the NVMe. Did you hear the reports that all the RAM memory prices are dropping? That would be lovely. Yeah, I know, right? Like markets bottoming out or whatever. Yeah. Just in time for everybody to switch to DDR5 next year. Nah, man, we're going back to Rambus. At least we're not going back to Gambus. Why are you acting fucky laptop? Now's not the time. Yes, it is. It's the perfect time. What is that, Shruggy? Is that the last of the hair? With the DNA up. Are you collecting DNA? Are you trying to make a mini Jordan? Yes. He thinks. Didn't stop you from licking it, did it? Joke's on you, it didn't come from it. Interfering with it? Ah. Oh, that's why it's throwing everything on high. That's why everything is running like shit right now. It's doing what? Uh, Rocket League is trying to run everything on 1080p high on my APU, and that's just not happening. Mm, really? Rocket League's like, I'm so yeah. high right now. Huh. Um... I mean, it... <sighs> I just kind of assumed it had enough juice to run Rocket League. It doesn't have enough juice to run Rocket League on the setting that I'm using, settings I'm using on my uh, 1080 Ti. The other thing too is that the what do you call it? Um, the CPU gets throttled when it gets hot, or fairly aggressively. Well, at least that GPU is what two, three times faster than Intel integrated. Why is this running like garbage? What the fuck? Go to training for a hot second. Maybe, maybe in game it's better. What GPU do you have in there? This is the Vega 10. I mean, you should be fine. Unless, what's your shared memory at? A gig, I think. Actually, That's you have Firefox. Probably your limit. Off. Firefox has to be shut down if you have it open. I did kill Firefox. Yeah. All right. That's generally what kills it for me most of the time. Now, is this actually going to work? No. No, no, no. Let's go. Good little my computer. Maybe it's the maybe it's the governor or something. I don't know. It's probably a VRAM limitation. All the governor is, it, a I mean, it, it could be, but a gig should be fine for like 720p medium. 
I mean, you probably should be able to do 720p medium and high mix. Why don't you yeah. open the Discord and close out? Um, yeah, that's Jitsu. yeah, that's uh, let's do that. And just hop into the Discord and get a chance. But I, all my advanced settings are on performance, performance, and high quality. I don't have any fancy things on at all. Is that better? Can y'all hear me? Yeah, yeah actually, I'm loud better. Pretty well. Yep. Okay, cool. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Killing, killing Chrome just dropped CPU usage down. So that's, that's yeah, yeah. And I have all my detail, my settings to performance, all of it. So Let's try this again. Yay! I wish there was a decent browser that didn't need all the resources. Well, if you think about what, what web pages are these days and the size of them, I mean, they're applications. It's the 100%. complexity and uh, all yeah. the rendering. I'm assuming. All the size calculations, everything that's been done. Um, I trust me, I do it every day because that's what I do at work. You calculate yeah, no, like, size. Yeah, like, even like, yeah. He's all about that size. Mm hmm. Yeah, these aren't tabs. I, I love your size, size, Jordan. Someone has to. Mm hmm. This is true. Uh, Van, when you got a chance, if there's room, can I get an invite? No. Um, if we, yeah. Jordan, are you in game or what am I doing here? Um, it's apparently launching. Oh, okay. Yeah. Give it a minute on uh, AMD GPUs. It takes a minute. Make sure it didn't minimize back to the track. That, 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 that's, that's what it did. Yeah, I have an RX 480 and it does that, but it works fine. Oh yeah. So I'll take it no one else has a machine powerful for the rocket leagues. Everybody else is doing shit. Yeah. Mm. Every, every, everyone else is having a party. I have some spare toasters if y'all need. The boy collects toasters. Leave him alone. Don't judge him. Hey, how else am I going to play Rocket League? Not with a fucking toaster, but I again, I don't I'm judge. Getting face fucked by. Oh, I love getting face fucked by toasters. You say that about everything. Yeah. I suck at Rocket League, but I'll invite if you got room. I don't know who the fuck said that, but. Oh, that's Haplo. Hello. All right. Oh, I could use a drink. Mm -hmm. Jordan mm. could use my computer. It's powerful enough, but he could. But that's not how Jordan rolls. I mean, it's 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 it's, it's, it's working fine now. Oh, good, good. Yeah, I'm I'm just I'm just doing some training to. All right. Vega 10, you should be able to run Rocket League. No, nah, man, you don't understand. Yeah. Rocket League is next generation <laughs> graphics. And... <laughs> so, uh, can I... somebody explain to me how third gen Ryzen, the lowest tier, is going to be a six bit? It's kind of insane. A six bit? Six cores, 12 thread on the Ryzen 3. Allegedly. Allegedly. Yeah. <laughs> no, it would be. It would. It would be. It would be nice if AMD could like start offering like more cores for very, very cheap. I think like ninety nine to one hundred and forty nine dollars. Yeah. Then, and the reason why no one else is playing is because LTE. That's why. Oh, occasionally. Fair um, so, because we wanted to keep Jordan d uh, dedicated um, internet, so without any interruptions. Which I appreciate. Thanks a lot, guys. I appreciate it. They're like worker ants. They're all working to get Jordan hey. onto Rocket League. I'm in Rocket League. I'm in the party right now. See you at the party, Richter. I even got Empty's crusty controller because someone misplaced my misplaces well, somebody took it PS4. they got a collector's okay. item yeah 
Yeah, I, yeah, I left it on the I left it on the kitchen table. It's probably around here somewhere. Somewhere. I, just gotta, somewhere. I gotta I gotta shake some people. I don't know, man. That tweaker <laughs> broke in. Stole it. Dude, it's Method Charlie. He's my boy. I'll just go talk to him. Get it back. <laughs> Where do I, I moved this? to the master bedroom because it's just too noise. <laughs> too much noise. <laughs> but then I I don't have anything I can watch in here unless I probably ended up in the refrigerator. <laughs> uh, so do you got everyone? Is no, I'm just gonna uh, like setting three? things up right now. Yeah. Here I'm going to. What the fuck is that? <sighs> Uh oh, what kind of spooky cube physics are we going to be fucking with tonight? None. Oh. None? Ah. Well, at this point, I'll be lucky to hit the ball if it stayed on me. So, yay. Happy, happy fun times. And who the fuck just dropped the thing, metal, whatever it must be? No, that was my phone. Okay, so metal. Right. Metal phone. That was... Whoa. What, what, whatever the sandstone material on the back of the OnePlus is, it's that. Yeah, metal. No, it's not. It's like plastic. My oh. seconds. Yeah, my, my, my phone is way cheaper than your S7. Well, I did buy this as a hand again. Again, my, my, my statement is still true. <laughs> I have no idea how it costs. I don't know if it costs more than yours or not. Well, it's Australian, so yes, it did. Just yes. You yeah, could have okay, a flip yeah, phone. Yeah, true, 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 true. <laughs> oh, crap. Um, oh, do we have two bots on our team? Yeah, if you, you do, do, it's a personal You're still problem. still winning, so... We got Myrtle and... Yuri. Thank you, Myrtle. Myrtle. Yeah, we do. I've centered that ball. No, you shouldn't have. No. Go, Yuri. Go, Yuri. You're my boy, Yuri. Damn it. No! Damn it, Fuck off, Jordan! I, just, I, just, <laughs> I saw you come screaming in. Well, hang on, move me out of the way. Ah. Uh. Fuck off, Jordan. No. I just want to get. I've given everyone here a hug. I'm out of people to hug. <laughs> Took our goals. Oh shit, I'm up there outside right? the goal. Oh, well, I guess I'm in net now? Okay. You are in net. God damn it. I am net. Hear me, vet. I yes. am net. Yes. All the points. Myrtle. You're getting beat by bots. I mean, we're all getting beat by the bots. In fairness, they're probably set on All Star because that's what I've been practicing with. So they, they can hit the ball? <laughs> I accomplished nothing, look at me, yay. I accomplished nothing! Previously on Driving Around the Ball. Yeah. This week. Come on, yeah. no. bot! No. Oh. oh. No wonder it missed, it wasn't a bot. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> really? All right, boop. Yeah. Oh, no, it wasn't a bot. He missed it. Ha. Mad hacks. Yeah. Net hack. Oh, Jordan. Oh, shit. No, stay that way. Stay that way. Stay that direction. Thank you. 
Poop it in. No. No. I want the suffering to last longer. I refuse. I just want to hit the ball. Yeah, life goals. Yeah, you, you, you and me both, sweetie. You and me both. <laughs> no, look, you hit the ball. Come on. Eleven. Oh, Van, that was beautiful. Not really. Ooh. Not really. Did not result in sucks. No. I touched the ball and it didn't go in the net. I'll call that a win. <laughs> well, I'm playing goalies, so I better call that a win. Yeah, might as well. Yeah. That's the... the... Oops. Ah! Oh, I oh, that was yes. Myrtle. I, I, Goal I got a, stealing I got, net, I got a network hiccup and I clipped through the ball. That was great. Oh. <laughs> now you missed the ball. No, all right. Well, so, something fucked up. It was me. <laughs> Welcome to my world, Jordan. Huh. Welcome to my world of clipping through balls and walls and cops. Hey, man, we don't need to discuss our Fox, sex lives. Clipping through walls with Foxy. <laughs> a new series on Netflix. God damn. No clip. Just getting away from these bots, man. They're a bit. No. Uh, they're a bit touchy feely. As in, they touch the ball and I feel bad. <laughs> oh! That was on me. Oh shit, I'm going wrong. I'm pointing wrong direction. Someone please get that. Get that. Oh, thank you, Heplo. Hey man, I, I drove into the goal and didn't do anything. <laughs> I was doing something stupid and I ended up outside the goal. Fuck you, bot. See, this is the problem. Now I just want to attack the bots. <laughs> what just happened? Silence. I did it. Silence. Science rules. Oh, nowhere near, but I'm going to pretend there was a oh, shot. Oh, Myrtle! One direction, thank you. Come on, Myrtle. Ah, yes. Myrtle! I went low, he went high. <laughs> oh, I got the assist. Ah. Oh, that was beautiful from the bot. Oh. I was trying to get in front of it, but it did not work. Damn, Myr Myrtle is savage. <laughs> I oh, ho, ho. <laughs> what? <laughs> Where's that guy? And, and this oh. is how we lost 10 0 to a bot. <laughs> we can just sit back, let Myrtle's got this. Yeah. So Apparently, you've recruited Skynet onto your team, hey, so... <laughs> Alright. Hey. Cocaine Voltron wins. Listen, I did better than Yuri, I guess. No, I didn't. Myrtle <laughs> <laughs> oh. wins. Myrtle, man. Alright, let's pop Myrtle. back to the main menu. Myrtle, and... pummel attack. We'll play three on three. Okay. I didn't mean to make that a yep. four on four. Yeah. Um, there we go. Something nice, a little easy. Some something light. Yeah. So something we can all agree that is a definitely a map. All right, I gotta check in. You're putting this on what? Neo Tokyo, aren't you? Fuck yeah, I am. Um, yeah. North Ranger, <laughs> main menu. That's what Finn does. North Ranger. <sighs> really, it's I'm not gonna get up and get a drink be like hey i'll get up and get a drink what was that north ranger uh north ranger oh i hit the... I need you on main menu i hit ready where did it go you're on main no menu. you gotta exit to exit to main oh. menu Fuck. yeah yeah main menu Fuck. as is tradition 
Yep, that way we can reset the teams. Although yeah. most of the time it doesn't work out that way. Gotcha. Yeah. Generally to give Vin time to screw us over. Hoplo. I'm coming one sec. <laughs> nope. Gotta be at my menu. There we go. Yeah. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Uh. All right. I just went auto on this one, so I got Pennywise and someone else coming. I have a black screen. Neat. Neat. And that is... Oh, that's because the fucking screensaver came on. Okay. Nice. <laughs> nice. We haven't played on this for quite some time. What the hell? Was... It's one of the originals. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's, it's an oldie. Come on, Jordan. Ah, no. Whoa, big swing and a miss. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm getting some periodic chugs because of the thermal throttling, so aiming is a little tricky. Bye, AMD kids. <laughs> don't, no, no, no. The, the, the real thing here is don't buy, don't buy AMD bitch thing pets. Nice slow goal. <laughs> Right over time. Where should I go? I'm who missed the ball completely. Now we Oh, almost. All right. Did. Almost. Good job. Oh, Scheissenhausen. No. Yeah. Listen. Scheisenhausen? Scheisenhausen. It's a word now. It's the only German I actually know, alright? Shit house. She's a shit. <laughs> do 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 do. House. Oh, 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 oh fuck! Oh, oh, come on. Really? Just bounce, bounce, in, bounce. In. Thank yeah. you. Yeah, I, I choked on that so bad. <laughs> Watch. I literally miss it by an inch. Yeah, ever. Everyone fails. Oh, oh, no, there we go. Pooped in. Us. Thanks. <laughs> no, that's the wrong way. Yeah, it Bad is. touch. No, fuck you. Ah. Uh -huh. No, no go for you. But then anybody else that would have easily bounced over All right, and just get over here. Mm -hmm. Oh, someone exploded. Yeah, I did. Okay. I don't know where I am. Oh, there I am. <laughs> yes. Oh no! God damn it! I got I got knocked into a fucking ball. I got knocked into the ball <laughs> to our direction. <laughs> oh, it's going back down that way. Oh, uh, oh that's a good cross. Uh, that's a good no. cross. Oh, oh. Uh, sucked to, me I, out. Second no. chance. Second chance. No. Oh, Pennywise, yes. that thing uh. you. <laughs> oh, hang on. Get off me. No. Yes. Mm. Rushing my windpipe. Just go in I already. <laughs> oh, where, where am I going? This way. Oh, you're not having that. Come on, Ablo. You got this. You had that. Nope. <laughs> I had it, yeah. I had it. 
I had it and lost it. I don't want ah. it back again. I could have been a pretender. Lord, Lord Jesus. No, 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 no. Yes. <laughs> Boom. Nice. Uh, I did Lord Jesus. Uh, no, that was, that was clean. That was clean. That was clean. Uh, yeah. I couldn't I couldn't get a straight line on it. <laughs> nice and safe, nice and safe. No boost. Fuck off, Betty Wise. Ooh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> oh, ho, ho. <laughs> oh. Yes. Safe. Nice safe. That uh, was more like a flail, but boost. we'll call it a save. Where the Pennywise, where the fuck are you pushing it? I don't know. <laughs> oh, Mir. Oh. Someone pick me up. You can walk it off, buddy. Come on. <laughs> oh, shite. Oh, the shite's up. Okay. Uh oh. <laughs> nope. Enough ranger got it before I did. <laughs> I'm just throwing myself in the general really direction of the bowl. I need another dose of RNG. Jesus. <laughs> Great flavor. If you've been taking RNG Jesus and your erection has it lasted for more than 10 hours, high five. Oh. <laughs> Quit bragging. For everyone else, you already did. Yeah, fuck. For everyone else, there's MasterCard. For everyone else, there's MasterCard. I unfortunately need to jump off. All right. Yes, Jill, we can hear you. I can hear you from the other side of the house. Please. I'll talk to you guys later on. All Thanks right. for the game. Right. See ya. Cheers. No worries. All right. Well, you want to do, do one more? Yeah, I guess we'll do one more. Bye-bye. One more. One more. Close, close it off, and then... Well, I don't know. That. i got some serious cleaning to do. I got some serious stuff to do. Yeah. About to. <laughs> yes. I, actually, shit, I got a pack. Right? Yeah. Yeah, I think that might be a good idea. <laughs> Going from Pasadena to LAX. What? Flying out of LAX. Yeah, to, uh, to YYZ. Get there at 5 o'clock in the morning. I'm gonna feel amazing. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't know. Ho hopefully it's gonna be one of those late night flights where like no one is on and I can just fucking pass out. Those are nice. Get the get the empty metal seat. Yeah. Or if I can or if, I you know they probably won't let me, but if like there's no one there, I might like be able just to mosey up to business class. They'll give Knock you business off. if you're nice about it. Yeah. I guess it's better than having empty in the middle seat. <laughs> I, I've, 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 I've already done that. We're, we're, we're good. <laughs> super light ball, oh, super fast boost. Oh, oh no, Ranger. Oh, it's it's two, it's me and Pennywise versus uh, two on two. Moxie and North Ranger. Two, yeah, all right. It's not it's not quite drop shot, but it'll do. Yeah. Yeah, close. I figured two on two drop shot would kind of be like womp womp. Yeah, that that that's that's the RNG Jesus. Oh, 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 you could have you could have got that, Michael. Oh no, but boost. I forgot it was in time. Yeah, the, the, the boost fucks you up. Nope. 
<laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> Listen, hitting cars is about the only thing I can do with this level of boost. No! No oh. fire in Jesus! No! Oh, well, oh, oh, no fire in Jesus! I totally meant to do that. <laughs> yes, of course. <laughs> This is the too, problem too, with the too boost. Much power. Yeah, like even if you tap it in the it's right direction, it can very well go in the wrong direction shortly after. Oh yeah, no. If, if you're off by like a degree, you're fucked. <laughs> Demolition. Least strat, brave, bold strategy, God, bold strategy. Yes. Uh... Uh, well, we got one. No Oh, pity wise. What direction. are you gonna do? What are you gonna Other do? Yeah. You can drive around it. That's what you gonna do. <laughs> there you go. Just drive backwards. Yeah. No. Regular Rocket League, you're very encouraged to use your boost in this so sparingly. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, for uh. fuck me! I got it. No, you don't. No, we don't. Quit lying to yourself. <laughs> oh, come, come on. Come on, RNG. Wise. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah. Oh. Boom. Nope. <laughs> no one wants to go for it. Fuck you, Pennywise. You aimed at me. I aimed at the is toilet. Is this going to bounce in? Is it? Yes, it is. Uh, oh, no. what a North Ranger. I tried to get around it, but I was going to go in anyways. There's no. Yeah, it was stuck in there. Yeah. Oof. <laughs> Hey, can I please not blow up? Oh, okay. That'd What's nice. gonna happen? Boop. And there it goes. Nope. Nope. Not oh, nope. too hard. No! 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 <laughs> nice penny ways. <laughs> we didn't all blow up. Nice. Progress. Yeah, I tried. Progress. <laughs> all right, Steve, I'm going to need to. <laughs> See how far you can get away from the lake station. No! No, it's not going in. What are you worried about? It's. <laughs> I saw that Jordan. Just going uh, down, down, flying forward. <laughs> I missed it. I don't know. I was more impressed ah, by Pennywise yeah. swing and a miss just then. Yeah, the, the, that boost really does punish like minor right. adjustments. Yeah. Oh, well, oh, oh, I thought it was going to go in. Fell off the habit of breaking after I boost. Oh, th th there's a break in this game? Yes, there is. Huh. Alpha. Oh, you shouldn't use it. <laughs> no, what? damn it. Oh. Uh. Why did I boost? Did never... you... Why the fuck am I on the ceiling? <laughs> nope. Too much acceleration. Oof. I landed on Mr. Fox Dog and he exploded. Oh. 
Pennywise with his please Stop nope. targeting me. Actually, you ran into me on that. No, I was targeted. <laughs> He's clearly a victim. Hey, Brian. See, he, he really hates people from Australia. <laughs> he clowns. He is a clown. Self-hating clown? Mm. Way, to, way to be a stereotype, anyways. <laughs> Self-hating clown. Oh, oh. overtime. Right, okay, right, so right. this is going to end on a curious, curious note. Oh. Uh -oh. Shite. Ping pong away. Where's it going to go? Oh. There's an interfering Canadian. <laughs> Is he just deletes? Oh. Just so you know, Foxy Pennywise was trying to take you out just then. Sure. Come on. Yes, 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 <sighs> yes. Come on. Let it oh, end. Oh, what? There it is. All right. There it's it over. is. It's all, it's all ogre. Uh, yeah, that was just... It is all just, ogre. Yeah, it's just going to roll across. The all ogre. Is that what you said to the uh, beard open more one guys? You're like, it's all ogre. Yeah. Well, no, it's open, it's open scene graph now. Whee! Well, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Get it? Uh, uh, uh. Yeah. Hey, shut up. It's fine. Uh, I only cry because it burns. Okay. Speaking of running out of happy. Yeah, I, 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 need, a, I need a happy recharge. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we're going to bounce out of here. Thanks everybody for showing up though, man. We did the scale thing. We got all that together. Yeah, that was great. It was fun. We learned a thing or seven. I don't know. Maybe we didn't. That's probably for the best though. We'll be back next probably. week. Probably. With a regular show. As he said. And a real computer this time. Compu yeah, I know, right? <laughs> we'll hang out in Discord for a few seconds before we call it a night. But, uh, yeah. Right on. Mm -hmm. Let's have another fun week. Dynafy. Yeah. Bye bye, folks. Mm -hmm. We love you, chat room. <laughs>